Dr. Pepper. Checking my notes here, my tasks for the day. I've got to get to the hospital. I've got to see what yes, see what sir. Ma's up to. Oh, uh, let's see. Got a lot of patients here today that are coming in. But as always, lots of unexpected visitors coming into the hospital. No, it's not a shithole apartment. It's the best I could do. Um, also, for the YouTube crowd, gotta let them know. There's t-shirts with beautiful dog on them. Look at that. It's oh, Dee the so, dog. So cute. Wow, look at that. A dog? Wow. Cool. That's one cool dog. So and, sick. And I'm a doctor. That's awesome. Wow, I want all oh, those mugs and there's pillows and socks and stuff to... Cool. Oh, <clears throat> such a cute dog. <clears throat> Where was I? Ah, yes. There's no time to waste. I must be going back to the hospital. The city needs me. The city is full of the sick, the ill, the injured. Hello there. On your way to the hospital? Oh uh, yeah, of course. Uh, I just lost my head, actually. Lost your head? Yeah, I had a really bad headache. You know, I, uh... Losing your head, that's no good. You've got to be no, more careful. No. You need to bring no. people to you. Now listen here. Next time you're feeling like that, just remember. Take two of these. There you go. Keep those on you. Those should what, help. What, what, what is that? Don't worry. I'm just so, a doctor. What, what kind of doctor are you with? You work at Pillbox Medical? Yes. Have you not uh, seen me around? It is I, Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper? Yeah, okay, okay, I don't know if I... I, I mean, I drank a soda can before that yeah, was Dr. Pepper, but I uh, got... Yes, 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 just like the soda. Yes, it's quite a coincidence. However, my name is Dr. Pepper. And it is no laughing matter. I didn't laugh. I'm not laughing at you. I just, uh, you know, there is another doctor on duty right now. Her name is Dr. Agnes Rambo. And, uh... Agnes Rambo? Yeah, yeah, she's on duty right now as well. All right, I'll have to introduce myself to this Agnes Rambo. I will also be searching for my friend Ma. Have you seen Ma around today? Mars? Yes, Dr. Dr. Ma. Ma, no, I haven't seen him. Um, yeah, I just got on duty a little bit ago, though, so, uh, yeah, I don't okay, really right. know. I mean, I've only met a few. I met Dr. Keith Cassidy, um, Dr. Tracy Martell, um, and pretty much that's it, I think. Dr. Serge Cross. Huh. Well, I will say it was a pleasure meeting you, Miss... What was it? Kate Lemons. Lemons? Los Santos CMS trainee. Lemons? Be, yes, Lemons. Yes, Miss Lemons. The pleasure meeting you. I, I guess nice I'll... Nice to meet you, too. I guess I'll, I'll like, be seeing you at Pillbox. Yeah, I'll be seeing you as well. I'm heading that way right now, so, uh... All right, well, we can... We can walk together. I guess so. I'll just leave this clipboard here. I won't be needing this one. This was yesterday's. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. <sighs> I'm sure someone will pick it up. Of course. The apartments do have quite the custodial arts among them. Some of the finest. Yeah, sometimes. I mean, uh... I mean, look at the mess up front there. just now. There's several cars topped over each other. Yeah, I noticed that too. Uh, I've never seen that many cars in one, one parking spot before. I think maybe they're doing a competition or something to see how many cars can fit into one parking spot. I do hope there are no injuries. Yeah, well, you know, sure, I'll just be sure to get them over to the hospital and treat them, you know, because uh, that's what I've taken a sworn duty to do, you know, my my life. 
work is to save people. Yes, as is mine. Tell me, Miss Lemons, how long have you been working as a trainee? Uh, just a couple days now. You know, I'm a new recruit. New recruit? Yeah, yeah. Interesting, interesting. You know, I have been trained all over the world. Oh, wow, that's impressive. Yes, lots of uh, work across several uh, third world countries, saving children, people of all ages all over the world. I've been flown out to many events. However, Pillbox is... Uh, it's run quite a, a tight little organization. It's hard to get in. My friend Maul's yeah, trying to put in a good word for me. Oh, wow, yeah, you got the best of the best at Pillbox. Yes, indeed. Uh, you know, that's what we tell all the patients when we pick them up. They're in good hands when we take them to pillbox. My friend Ma has been working for some time. I do believe he is one of the finest on the force, the medical field. Oh, wow. Well, you know, I look forward to meeting him. Yes, as a trainee, I'm sure he as well as I will have much to show you and teach you. Um, but she's also very sweet. Just, uh... Watch where you're going, Sam. Jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, my gosh. I tell you, the people of this city have run amok. There's something in the air. Toxins. Los yeah, Santos yeah. does have quite low air pollution. I mean, high air pollution, low quality air. Yeah, that's why sometimes I like to wear my spit guard just to help with the, uh, you know, air quality. Because it helps with that as well. And also just because I produce a lot of spit. Yeah, that's actually pretty smart. Oh, great. Look here. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Some good Samaritans. Oh, jeez. Well, I didn't God. think I would find dead bodies on my way to work. Oh, my goodness. Oh, you're bleeding. No, I'm not. Here, Excuse me, my doctor. Is everyone all right here? Oh, uh, dear. No, his car is broken. He needs yes. repairs. The tire just sort of blew up. Yeah, yep. I'm okay. That's Jake's fault, though. Are you a doctor? Uh, yes. Oh, what's wrong with your knee there, sir? I see you favoring. Oh! 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 Oh, oh my oh. gosh. You gotta get out of here. Oh, I should probably get to work. Oh, God, yes. Okay. Yes. Oh. Ouch. Damn. Ah, my right thigh is very painful. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Oh, great. We got a security guard down. Ouch. Greetings, folks. Sir, it's clocking are you in. Okay? Yes, I'll, I'll see myself. Oh, they got a new gift shop. Cool. Oh, jeez. This bum leg. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Please, ma'am, no running in the hospital. I said no running! <laughs> Should be locked up. Damn zoomers. I'll just uh, access some bandages for myself. Till Ma gets here. You can diagnose yourself, right? I'll wait, see if maybe Ma could take a look at it. It's always best to get a second opinion. <laughs> I'd rather have a second opinion, of course. Ah. Where the hell is he? Oh, let's see here. Do I have him in my phone? That would help. I think this is a laughing matter. Ma! Ma, are you in there? I don't think he is. I don't think I have his number. He has mine, though. That I'm sure. Let me see. What is, uh... Let me back out of this. Let me hit myself. A little bit of this. A little bit of that. That's mine. Yes. Yes. Ow. Car came out of nowhere. Goddamn car. Car out of nowhere. 
Now, what is... This place is a mess. These prescriptions, all these credentials, they're all out of order. They're all out of whack. How am I supposed to work in these conditions? How do you become an official doctor? Dr. Pepper actually isn't an official doctor yet. He's still under a trainee. He's under clinical review. Under review, they say. Oh, sure, yeah, I've been sent across the world. Oh, everybody's dead, but they're all outside. <laughs> well, that's always a good sign. Well, I can't do anything until Mars here anyways. This old monologue. Ouch. Damn. Ouch. Ah. Oh. Very painful. Ah. Oh. Ah. <laughs> DeVry Medical. <sighs> DeVry, DeVry, DeVry. You're gonna die. You got me this far. I know, but it'll be funny. Oh, I'm just saying. I know. Oh, DeVry. Brings me back. It's been some time. I was in that DeVry med school. A lot of my classes were over the phone. Online. It was uh, quite convenient. I have a PhD. I was able to work day shift. Grocery stores. Sears outlet. Quite the handyman before I got into all this medical mumbo jumbo. But there was the. Slash. Fuck me in the ass. Dr. Pepper, PhD. Dr. Pepper, Dr. Moore, PhD. Oh, Moore! There you are! Ah, oh, good thing! You're coming to work today! Yes, I have already got to work. Uh, you need to get here quick. I am not feeling well. People around me are dying. I've only got two hands more. Allow me to assist you with two more. I shall be there shortly. I just drew deposits on my ridiculous... Do hurry, Ma. Do hurry. Coming, good sir. I am coming. All right, Thanks. I'll see you shortly. I'll start uh, working through all of the, the files. It's all out of whack. I don't know who was working the shift before us, but it's it's not very it's not looking good over here, Ma. Typical clumsy and chaotic other doctors. It's you and I that require to clean up this town with professionalism. Yes. Professionalism. Now hurry! Don't be late! Coming. Hurry! Where was I? And uh PhDs. Yes, don't I got my PhD at DeVry University. And then I transferred to get my MD. Not a lot of people go that route. It's what separates the men from the boys. Try to talk to me as if I don't know what the hell I'm capable of. That's what they said. So oh, people don't usually introduce themselves as PhDs. Yes, I do. I worked hard for it. A doctor of medicine. And many other things. It's rather learned. What's his PhD in? I don't know. What do you think it is? Irony. I was going to say... Chat, what do you think it is? Go ahead. Dance? <laughs> I worked hard. <laughs> Theater. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, yes. monologuing. Theater. <laughs> Theater. A thespian. Thespian arts. On to Vry University's online course. A doctor of the arts. I would submit videotapes of myself <laughs> acting through Devi's FTB website, and it would be reviewed while still wearing my grocery store uniform. To be or not to be. That was the question. <laughs> that was the question. Sir? Uh, yes, sorry. 
was mo was monologuing in the window. Uh, how can I help you? Hi, I've never seen you before. Do you are you a doctor here? <clears throat> yes, well, the name is Dr. Pepper. Oh, okay. All right, well, this guy uh, is almost dead. Okay. Time to get to work. He's been falling asleep at the wheel quite a bit. Yeah. What's going on? How's this guy doing? Ah, uh, Dr. Pepper. Oh, ah, Ma, good to see you as well. All right, the patient Wait, seems to have fallen down the... Is that right, Mr. EMS? Fallen down the stairs. Light cases of narcolepsy. Also seems to be old and has a leg brace. Looks like... Oh, a tennis player. Good oh, God. God. I think he's a golf player, actually. Golf. Take note, of the the shoes. <gasps> Take note he of the knee brace. Player. It's worse than that. Okay. All right, we're going to hook him up right now. Here we go. Get him on the beep boop. Beep boop on. All right. About the boop beep. The beep bop boop -a -bop, -bop, bop bop He's booping. He's beeping. All right. This is me a lot of blood. Uh, Dr. Pepper, if you assist me in cleaning up the excess blood, I'm going to look at his... Looks like his mid-spine region has taken some severe damage. There's a bulge in the back. Oh god, not the spine mid. The spine mid, everyone! No! Spine mid! No! That's like the middle of the spine, oh shit. Okay, I'm this going to apply. This spine high. Sir, are you with me? What is your name? Sir, can you hear us? Sir! Uh, yeah, I can fucking hear you, goddamn. Shit. I'm he can hear us. Right he here. can hear us. I'm That's right good. Here. Okay, good, he's conscious. All right, I'm going to apply a little bit of pressure to your spine. Tell me if you okay. feel this, okay? Yep. Yep, yep. Okay, good. Yep. He has a nervous system that's still intact. Yep. Fantastic. Yep. Good, he's not completely dead. Exactly. All right. At least we know it's not terminal, gonna... folks. We can all calm down. Yep. I'm going to have to do a light incision and release some of the swelling. Are yep. you ready? Yep, yep. Following, you following yep. your lead, Ma. Okay. Yep. Hooking up the intravenous. All right, we'll give him a shot of Demerol to numb the location. All right, I'm preparing to do the incision now. Careful. Okay, we're going to remove some of the excess pus. Science, okay. help us all. Okay, looks like he's dislocated one of the vertebrae. He's, he's like gargling it. on something. He's gargling on something. Oh, come on. No. Dr. Pepper, check his, check his mouth. I'm going to keep working on his spine. I'm checking his mouth. What? His mouth is full of liquid. I was just, I was just playing with my spittle. And teeth. Yeah. Oh, he's playing with his spittle. Oh, yeah. goodness. You okay, want, make sure you he want me to teach you check, how? Check for dentures. Make sure he doesn't swallow them. No, okay. no, 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 no these are real. Teeth. These are I'm real teeth. Damn right. Lots of oh. fillings oh. over here, but these are real teeth indeed. Yeah. Fucking yeah. impressive for your age. Usually it's been yellow and brown by this point. I'm popping in the mm -hmm. net spine. Here we go. What are you trying to say? You trying to say I'm old? There's the part. There's the spine. All right. There we are. Okay. Now. Fantastic, I'm going to stitch up the womb in the mid-spine region. Let's Do be careful here. on that spine mid. I know, I understand the difficulties and dangers of being in a spine mid, but damn it, doctor! I'm going to go there! Here we go. All right, final stitching in. Fantastic. Dr. Pepper, if you want to go ahead and apply the bandage on that, I'm going to look to all, down towards his leg. Apply bandage! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no, wait, no, what no. the fuck? What's oh, happened? Someone assist, Dr. Pepper! What? I got you, bud. Okay, I'm gonna apply a pressure bandage to the leg. What just happened? Who calls the doctor? I need a doctor! I need a doctor! I need a doctor! Let me get him in a bed, hang on. We need a doctor for a doctor! There's a doctor! We need a doctor for a doctor! Oh my god! Science, help us! Oh. oh my goodness. Hold on, my friend. I'll be with you shortly. Could this be the end of Dr. Pepper? I thought I could do it. I thought I could perform under such dire straits, my own health at risk. But it was a risk I was willing to take. Uh, excuse me, sir. Uh, doctor. Okay. Uh, uh, what Are happened? You a doctor who? No, I'm not. Ma, I, I tried I, I, to do I the impossible. I tried, what did you do? I tried to uh, work right, through the pain, but I was suffering oh, on the inside. Yep, there you go. You get to go. 
That's because ah, you are one of the most right. goddamn professional yeah, doctors David. this industry has ever seen. You're you goddamn work right. pain, both physically and mentally. You are above and beyond any other doctor I have ever met in my entire life. Bracria, I salute you. I call you. It will be an honor to work on you as uh, a colleague. As uh, a friend. I got here as quick as I could. But you did marvelous. on the way, I was struck by a vehicle. I have internal bleeding. I know it's true. Well, let me internally fix you. And perhaps internally we will learn something together. Are you recovered? All right. I'm going to do a slight I'm going to give you an injection of Demerol to numb the area. You know the drill. Dem me up, boy. Dem me up. I'm going to finish up playing Love Island. Who should I go on a date with? Rohan All right. I'm going to remove some of the excess blood. Yes. Gohan. Rohan. Oh. Mel, what do you like better? You're very lucky. Or should I say talented? Stellar stellar. For even when you're wounded, it misses stellar, stellar. the main artery. I tried my best What's to favor the other leg, hoping that the blood would not clot. Or 2001. So impressive. Even when in damage, you're able to be impeccable. Damn it, I tried more. I tried. Don't even start with me. You did. Just try. You did. You did. <sighs> okay, here we go. Too? You see what you see what I gotta do with uh, Excuse me, Protozoa yeah. right. was a fucking snack, don't you? You're even... stitched up. You're wrapped no, up. I'm now not. rise. Rise! Okay, so what should I do my medical yeah, friend? Yeah, is there's yeah, work that know. needs to be yeah, done. Yeah, That's yeah, right. Gone. We don't right, lay no, idly in the yeah, night. We're just hanging out with We work all through it. We rise above the challenge. Oh, you're gonna get up. I you, fell under help? the bed. I think I re-injured yeah. myself. Hemophilia yeah. could be. It was the doctor. Oh. Let, let me help you. Yeah. I, I got oh. you. I got you. There we are. How about now? I'm ready to work, Ma. Let's get to work. Fan. Fucking tastic. Okay, let's go. Let's go patch the sky that. up. Let's go check on that geezer and make sure everything's fine. God damn it. Victory spins. Dr. Pepper, I know you've just suffered an almost fatal injury to your leg, but I'm going to ask something of you very dear. Will you assist me in picking up this elderly man? Yes, I believe I still can favor my left leg. Hoping that the blood clot will not form in my right, it's a risk I'm willing to take for this man here. You are such a professional and so brave. All right. I think are you, you want to lift with your, your legs, not with your back. No, I think it's the other way around. Is Dr. Pepper an actual, like, doctor? Yes. No, you yes, know. I no, am. Of course. No, of yes, I'm yes, yes very similar to the soda, oh, yes. Oh, no. He's here interning. Okay, get ready. Wait, Chang's what? an intern? Is he, sleep Is he sleeping? <laughs> That's his narcolepsy. Yeah. Where am I? His epilepsy's kicking in. Where am I? You're at the hospital. I got a chronic necrophilia. Wait, what? Are you a yeah. necrophile? Oh Necro my god. Necrophilia? He just said oh he has chronic god. necrophilia. Jesus Christ. Sometimes I just pass out. Yeah. My grandma oh had my that. Oh my god. No, she did not. What? You didn't it's know her? Same it's same narcolepsy. Who cares? Pepper, you it's narcolepsy. It's, it's, it's a big difference. Well, I'll tell you right now, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, uh, prepared to deal with necrophilia. I know the cure for necrophilia. Hold on. No, my fucking God. Excuse me, sir. Sir, I think you might be mistaken. Not necrophilia. Not necrophilia. He just needs you to hang in there. There's an old man over there. He's suffering from minor necrophilia. I was wondering if you could lightly seduce him with your middle agedness. That she is a good cure for him. Uh, you saw my nice little titties over here. Okay, I could do that for Bring you. Bring me your titties. Thank you. What I just, just go up to the gentleman it's and just lightly SPSPR. seduce him. Usually that Jane. shakes the shit out of necrophilia. You want these titties all up in your face, baby? <laughs> You like that, baby? Genius, Ma, you've perfectly simulated necrophilia. It's amazing the amount of negativity that comes into an adominant male when they are faced with such erotic behavior from the same sex and when they are not attracted to the same sex. Good God. It's an amazing cure for oh. necrophilia sometimes. 
Side effects may include trauma, but oh, it's worth the risk. One. Some of them get them like Xanax or something. Put him right to sleep. There you go. Come we easy. smack him off his face right there. Yeah, maybe a couple light smacks in the face should wake him up. There you go. Get some of them titties. There you go, Malbec. What was that? What the fuck was what that? What was that? Pop his... Just did his butt plug come out? Was I that... think that's what it was. A little pressure building up. Pressure? Oh, you're going to scare you if you can. Does that mean can you feel you? Uh, where are I, Why are you, you people hurt? in my fucking bedroom? There you go, Mama. Just, just, just worry is, about your titties. Oh, that's God. all. It's like a fucking... So I'm sorry, like Dorothy, Dorothy, but you're in not in Kansas right now. It's like you're in the hospital. smacking me in the face with a condom filled with animal fat. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> no, that's pure and natural blastuses. <laughs> Splendid work. You may be confused right now, but you will thank me later. Clap two. Now you gotta get up. Alright, is that enough doses, doctors? <laughs> yes, yes, yeah, I'll out? give you 50 bucks for your free, for your time. Hey, thank yeah, you. Oh, thank you. Oh, wait, where did, where did you just- Oh my god! Where the fuck am I? Wait, where did Chambers <laughs> go? Oh, no. uh, oh, god. oh, oh dear. He went uh -oh. back to heaven. Oh, oh my gosh. Bye, Chang. I must be seeing Through things. Through the drywall again, I swear to god, if they wouldn't cut budgets down to like one millimeter thick drywall, I swear. We, um, EMS, we might need your sister to find him. I believe he fell through the floor. He might be in the sewer again. Oh, don't even take this guy seriously. Hey, Doc, can you help me stand up? Mm, Dr. Top Hat. On duty. They're on duty. You ain't got to deal with them. All right, here we go. You ready? Is that a yeah. Top Hat? And... Can he not see me? <laughs> a Top Hat. I can't get up. Oh, hold on. I think I'm on the wrong. There's a lot of people around. There's right a now. place of medicine. All right. Three, two, one. Yeah, I'm a hey, doctor. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 okay. You, top hats. Okay. You can wear a top hat, too. Maybe cover up that bald patch you got going. Thank I'll you so much. Pardon her. She's the coroner. Well, thank, thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. Let me, let me shake your hand, Bolly. Yeah. Of course. Hey, like um, don't you owe me money? Of course. Do you want to go check out that last Thank you so much. Happy you're feeling better. I'm, I'm going to run down with the uh, Tahoe yeah, to check this out. Be careful out there. Out there. Like Be careful out there. Huh? I need to tell you something. Your colleague, if he ever calls me old again, have a good night. Come on, be with me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come be with me, gentlemen. Or just you. Or just Bobby. Whatever works. Yes, there's quite a full house tonight. Your, uh, your colleague. If he ever calls me old man again, I'll shoot you in the throat and make him watch. Noted. Noted. Hmm. It's gonna be one hell of a day. Severe case of malting on that one. Put these files away. Yes. Bald man. Molding. Necrophilia. Old man titties were the cure. Perfect. What the hell? It used to be pressing again and it would cancel the clipboard. Now I gotta drop them everywhere. Do you think I'm playing games? You think this is a fucking game? I'm very thankful that you stitched me up. But if you call me old man again. I'll make you leak out your goddamn throat like you ate a fucking bowl of cereal Oop. and spat it all out, eh? <clears throat> you know, for being on this planet for as long as you have, you'd think you would learn <clears throat> the words really don't mean that much. Don't you willing to end someone's life over a little bit of verbal spat? Is that what I'm hearing? Oh, I'm a changed man. You hear that, guys? Prune Gang's not gonna go after anyone for calling them old anymore. You know, thank you. Thank you so much. I never thought about it that way. Game I time. never, <laughs> ever thought about it that way. Did you really never. just brandish a firearm inside the hospital? Do you have any idea of the severity of that? I never thought about it like that. Kick these under the chair. I never, ever thought about it. I think he's trying to reflect the idea with the high pitch that like he's being that. sarcastic. I don't know if this one's walking away completely healthy, Ma. I'm sensing some mental issues as well. It might but be best to let this one sort of just down. go. Yeah, you picking it up? You picking yeah, it up? Yeah, I'm picking it up. I'm picking it up. Good. Tell you what. You're welcome. 
for the medical help. And I'm sorry that you get so uh, hurt over words. I, oh, I didn't this, say though. I was hurt, I will fella. not forget this. You won't forget it? Listen. I'm just trying to level with you. I don't think you really know who you're talking to. I really don't think you grasped that just yet. Haven't grasped it. Well, then, fill our ears with the ever-soothing words of your iconic ego statue that you're going to lay upon us. Go ahead. Yeah, what, what was your name, too? I don't have it here on the clipboard. Yeah, I mean, uh, I don't have it on file. My name's Eugene. File. Eugene Zuckerberg. Eugene, Eugene Zuckerberg. Zuckerberg. Yeah, Eugene Zuckerberg. Just like yeah, uh, the Facebook Zuckerberg. guy, Zuckerberg? Yeah. Just like, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. The Z. Related at all? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. He's my grandson. Oh, shit. No way. Cool. Okay. Anyway. Long story short, <laughs> the elderly community in this town, we command a certain level of respect. They don't like the O word. And we politely ask Jesus. that you not use the O word. And if you continue to use the O word, or cease to be, or refuse to be, apologetic about using the O word, we put you, you in the fucking well, dirt. Elderly. Well, what do you prefer? The senior word? The retired word? The pension word? Just don't call me old fella. No. The G word's good. Distinguished. Grandpa. Grandpa distinguished. Yeah, that'll work. Grandpa, antique. distinguished, elder. Yeah, whatever works, man. But okay. if I hear Everything old man leave your lips old. again, I'll slice them off. Hostility. Yeah, yeah. I wrote that down earlier in the clipboard. Hostile. Okay. All right. All right. Mr. Zuckerberg doesn't like OLG. Okay. Yeah, be careful. Oh. All right. Noted in the dog. Well, all right, I think you've made your point very clear in your alpha dominance. You've, you've metaphorically peed all over the hospital, and now you're the big boy. I kind of want to just shoot you in the fucking face because you're not really grasping the severity of the situation. That's what my gut's telling me. I'm grasping it. I grasped it. Old and angry. Ma, you just stood there and gave him your cold, dead eyes. How the hell did you do that? We don't tolerate bullets in the hospital. No. Yeah, I used to have a crowbar for that, but the cops took it from me. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to get brandished a gun, my goodness. Why don't I have a crowbar? Excuse me, are you also a trainee in the trainee program? No, I'm a guy trying to get his record straight. Okay, well, this is a place of medicine. He's looking actually one of his uh, lawyer, lawyer or judge, who is it? Judge Odson. Uh, Mark, excuse me, correct me if I'm wrong, but are we here to cure those who are ill and sick? Or are we here to set our lives straight with lawyers? In this building. Uh, no, well, he's I'm been here told to do community to do... service. Yeah, an community service. Oh, so that's are... what this file yeah. is the community service Mohawk file. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't see uh -huh. it when I came in. Sorry, excuse me. What's your name there, pal? Yeah, Wade Wilson. Wade Wilson. Oh, yes. That's what it says right here. Wadey Wilson y. Cool. Sorry about okay, the well, confusion. That's, that's good to hear. Mr. Wilson, I believe. Well, the first thing we can do is the first thing you could possibly do is get into something that's a little more fitting for the hospital the look you're looking for right now is um comfort and cozy and welcoming and approachable right now you look like an extra from mad max or deadpool oh hey dr ma <laughs> nope hello uh, yeah, okay. and one other from the okay, tell you what. go down to the go down to the clinic store pick up something nice that was quick I'll, I'll compensate you for the cash when you get back and make yourself more approachable and printable and then we'll put you at the front desk and get you to work okay Oh, yeah, all right, all right. I'll go. I, I Good seeing you, Wade. Yep. In my body. Thrown off my bike. <sighs> <sighs> Fucking locals. Bike accident, okay. <laughs> my Thank goodness. You. Well, you're in luck time. today. One of the best, and I repeat, best doctors in the goddamn world is here. Assisting me, Dr. Pepper. Oh, Ma, I'm just following your lead today. Don't, no need to, no need for go all that. Go ahead and lie down and he will take care of you. I'm going to get to the other patient. Yeah, squatting in high heels is not good for someone in your condition. And what happened yeah. to you, sir? Uh, how's it going, doctor? I, uh, 
Uh, I exited my vehicle oh. in a not so uh -huh. gently manner. All right. All right. I'm just going to prep you for when Ma comes back. Uh, okay. What I could do. What's what's bothering you? Uh, well, just re re honestly, just all over. Just I'm so sore. I hope I didn't break my back. Okay, back. Okay, sore. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna go ahead and just prep the beep boop. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Well, it looks. I'm not seeing any bruising. From also, it's gonna be hard for Ma to work on you with the helmet on. You might wanna. I'll, I'll see if he can get that off of you. <laughs> oh, okay. Just this one time. Just this one time. Okay. Well, what did we learn? I'm definitely putting three seat belts next time. That's the spirit. Perhaps a three point or even a five point. Okay, good boy. Okay. <laughs> we'll do, Doc. Another one without a seat belt. Damn. <laughs> All right, Dr. Pepper, if you want to go ahead and assist this one with casting and such, uh, she's, she should be good for you to inspect and take care of. Okay. By the way, I got some good news. What? All right, the back's not feeling well, huh? Yeah. Let's go ahead and put some pressure there. Sorry. Does that hurt? Oh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, just a, yeah. Just a bit. Just a, yeah. Uh. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, that's not good. No, her name is. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, 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 I think so I pulled multiple Kate muscles. Lemon. Oh, multiple muscles. Okay. Oh, what is this? Let's what see here. Doc? Yes, this does not feel. This does not feel good. This does not feel right. This, nope, not right at all. Uh, oh, oh, no. Nope, it's all oh, out no. of whack. Everything here is wrong. All the muscles, okay. the way they connect, it's all wrong. Oh, I'm his husband. He's not gonna make it. It's the thigh bones connected to the. Handbook? That's what I was told, like yes, that. but that appears yeah. not to be the case with you. Oh, now. Oh, oh, no. Uh, jeez, okay. Let me go ahead and get the files right ahead. I need to get this in order. What was your name, miss? Uh, April, April, April Thompson. April, April, April Thompson. No. Just... April, April, April? Just, oh, just one, just one. Is that two middle April. names with a hyphen? Just, just one, just one April. April, 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 okay. Got it. All right, April. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a little and uh, put, put a little bit of a cream here on your back. Oh, uh, sunscreen? I, I don't need that. No. Doctor, he's not gonna make it. You won't need any SPF. No, I, Something I, to I, a, no. a local anesthetic. That's all. We can split it. Should be warm. Oh, oh. Little oh. warm. I'm just going to oh, work it into dead. the muscles. That's all. Okay. Okay. Oh. All right. He's dead, everybody. We've got to go. We've, he's dead. Uh-oh. April, what I'll be back. I think over something's there. going on over here. He's giving birth, doctor. Doctor, he's giving birth. What the oh. hell's going on over here? He's giving birth. He's giving birth. It's coming out. I see it. Push, Tank. Push. That's our son. No, it's his family oh, this coming. To me oh, my God. Week. Good God, Ma. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh, jeez, oh, I'm not prepared to handle such a, a male birth. Good God, gonna be sick. Oh, push, Tank, push. Oh boy. Ma, I don't know if I can handle that one over there. Male birth is no I, laughing matter. I, I don't even know what's going on. What the... Don't worry, April, what, April, April. Is this the real world? I, I've never heard of a male giving birth. What the... okay, Jay? What? Ma, I put a local uh, anesthetic no, on her lower back. Is, is, is this the side effect the of the cream? Yes, the cream is working. It's magic. It's it's making me witness male birth. Uh, don't worry, April. Just just stay there. We'll be right with you. Uh, okay, okay. In the mall. Good God. What? What? I don't know. I, I thought he was giving explain. birth. Is he all right? I was asking if he passed. Whatever he was passing, I, I, I don't, I don't. No, see. I suck it back in. It's not white. No, sir. You do not want to prairie dog a kidney stone. It is not wise. You could get an infection. It needs to bake more. No, no, no. You need to pass the kidney stone once. It's not oh. an in and out, in and out sort of thing. That only makes it worse. Oh, shit. What does your diet Go. consist of? Why do you have so many kidney stones inside of you? 
Well, I start my day with a couple quack rocks. And maybe a couple burger, a couple water, a couple more quack rock. Now with a hooter, more quack rock. Quack and rocks. Quack rocks. Quack rocks? Are you sure you're passing kidney stones and not just crack rocks? Have you been eating them whole? Like popcorn? Yes, I've been eating them. It's the newest trend. Good God! All right, let's see. Here, I'm gonna put this in your mouth. It should help dilute the crack rocks. Yes, here's another one. And another one. It's gonna fizzle up in your stomach and sort of break them down, and then you're gonna take. Well, you're going to pass them. That's all oh, I'm going to say for now. I'll leave it as a surprise for you. Oh. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to get back to rubbing more warm cream. I need help getting up. You need help? Oh! Yep, yep. I'm going to go look out this window. Okay. Uh, By the way, that's the window of more. Wow, she recovered. Fine. Listen, I cannot, I cannot be perform, I cannot pick you up. Ma is going to do. Oh, hey, Ma, there I you are. It. Yes, he needs I help. Got it. Don't worry. He's been eating crack rocks, Ma. They're not kidney stones. The drugs. Well, let's use this downer and turn it into an upper, shall we? All right. Oh, yeah. Deep within you, I want to, you to channel the inner of your crackiness. Use that energy to get yourself out of that bed. Are you ready? I'm wet. All right, one, two, three. Ah. Oh. Oh. He's getting up. Get up. Rise. Rise. I don't know. Do you think it was too soon to get him up? He might collapse under his own weight. Hold on. You'll be, you'll be surprised by the power of crack. There we go. Oh. How do you feel, sir? I feel like I need some quack right now. Feels no. like he needs. I'm gonna write this down. Like he needs crack. Obviously, we cannot prescribe that. That is heavily illegal. But you know, whatever they do in their free time outside this hospital, we have no control of. But we can only give advice, but not actually demand it. So but you would advise me to consume some more quack to help balance everything out? No, no, no. We need to give him something to replace it. Something to replace crack. What could <sighs> replace crack? <sighs> what can replace the sweet and savory taste of crack rock? That's a great question. Methrop? Could give him some Adderall. That work, Maul? Are we allowed to do that? Adderall? Galoxy? Hmm. I don't know. Uppers? It's risky. It is. Could just lead to another problem. It's just a vicious cycle. Oh, well, I should kind of. I love that. First and foremost, how do you feel energy wise on a scale of 1 to 10? Pretty well. I think I need a wee feel. He's slurring his speech a bit, Ma. Do you hear that? Eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Eyes a bit drowsy. Hard to keep standing up. A little bit dizzy. Feel like energy's all time low. Yeah. I feel pretty weak. He's kind of wobbling now. Just standing there on his own weight. Well, it's, it's not good. If you don't mind, he's not asking too much to do. He got a bloody one right here. This is the emergency. Oh, he's fucked up. Fucked up. He was just here. Okay. Literally, in what my medical fuck? profession, he, he got fucked up. Yeah, he really fucked up. All right. Yeah, he, he's I'm like going to give you something here to help. Dr. Pepper. Yes. He got hit by a car and, like, got, right. got like hit 25 oh. feet yeah. down the road. Hit by a car. Were you out there looking for those little crack rocks again? <laughs> no, I, he was just crossing the street. Oh, is he unconscious? Sir, can you hear me? He's oh. been coughing up blood. Oh no, he's definitely hanging in there. Sorry, I just overheard him talking to his friend about eating all these crack rocks. You know, the kids are getting into that these days. <laughs> it's not good for them. We keep trying to tell them, but they don't listen. We got a name on this one? That's Garrett. It must be. Garrett, I'm going to go ahead and put your name, your folder in the unhealthy pile. What? Sorry, that's the way it is. What do I know? I'm just a doctor. All right, Ma, oh, we got a it? we got a car accident on this one. Car accident? Okay. Uh, EMS, what's the breakdown on this one? He got hit by a car and dragged like 30 feet. He's... Yeah, he's, he's, he's like coughing and making gurgling sounds. Coughing, gurgling sounds, ejected from a vehicle. Uh, I'm not any... ejected. He was just struck by a vehicle yeah, when he was crossing the road. Struck by one. Struck, yeah, struck, yeah. 
I'm right across the street from Pillbox. That's why we didn't really do anything because we just kind of, you know, took him out the road straight up here. Mid body sweet by the looks of it. Look at uh, look at his thigh there, Doc Pepper. Do you see the bruising? Yes, it's quite messy, bloody bruisey. Oh, right. Okay, we're going to stitch that up right now. There we go. Yes, I'm seeing a bit of a uh, bit of some cuts here on his arm. If I may, Ma, I know you are leading this little lesson here, but if I may take this arm. You may. All right. Let's see, it's a little snip, snip here, snip, snip there. All right. Yeah, there we go. A little alcohol there. Clean it up. All right, now. Oh, this part's going to hurt you more than it's going to hurt me. Oh, please, Doc. All right, I'm going to use the thickest needle we got. This is a big cut. <laughs> oh, no. Just Don't hang in there. We're almost done. Oh, shit. Is that the old, that's the old needle you used back in Guatemala? Yes, the 12 gauge needle. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. Like a sawed off buckshot. Here we go. Last one. I need you to bite down on this for me. Here we go. Three, two, one. Hell! Oh, that was a close one. Almost lost this arm. You're not getting gangrene, not today. Not today. All right, he's patched up. Thank you for this opportunity, Ma. And the other med team. Thank you. Opportunity. I call it a privilege. It's been an honor to work in front of all of you, truly. Please, Ma. Is he gonna live? He's still gurgling. I don't know about that, Ma. You wanna. You wanna take the. You have to. Uh, Dr. Pepper, the, the thing you told him to bite down on. You oh, to sorry. It. Forgot. Uh, yeah, let me uh, get that. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, Jeez. Uh, all right, good sir. You've been stitched up, bandaged up, ice packed up, and drugged up. Are you ready to stand up and face the world again? And maybe, just maybe, look both ways before crossing the fucking street. Fill me up, doctor. All right. One, two, three. <gasps> up, 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 up. It's easy wow. now. You're a true hero, doc. How do you feel? A miracle. My miracle God. Science. science help us. All hail science. Science. How do you feel, Fitness? sir? Honestly, like a million bucks. It's a success. You're welcome. Is this the man that hit me? Is that uh -oh. him? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh That's not a scalpel. Sir? 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 Please. Come back here, mother trucker! Hey. Run! They knew you deserve you hit you with a car! Okay, hold on. You might want to chase him. Yeah, you guys might want to chase him. That's going to be a, it's going to be a case, surefire case of a EMS call. Ah, oh, here we go. Welcome back. Excuse me, ma'am. Are you hiding in the hospital? I was just, I was waiting my moment before I could speak up. You? Hey, I've got Hello, this really Gladys. weird, hey, sweetheart, i got a weird rash I need y'all to look in. Okay, well, one second, Gladys. I have a wonderful idea. Dr. Pepper, would you join me by the window? You two stay right here. I'll be right, we'll be right back with you. Yes. How you doing? <laughs> How you doing? All right, we have someone else to do community service, and we have an elderly woman. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Let's see. Community service, elderly. What are you thinking? Well, obviously, she's older, needs help getting around and moving and doing things. We can get rid of them. Changing adult diapers, etc., etc., and he's looking for things that have to do with his lawyer in order to do community service to get on the right path in life. Yeah, we could uh, send him off to go show her about the town. Walk her across the street. Get the street, her yes, the maybe street. Do some cardio. Yes, a grab. Bit of physio to yes, her moving her muscles. Grab stuff that's up high. Grab stuff and that's down low. Maybe they'll even fall in love. Shit, who knows? Age is just a number. But I'd say we line this thing up. Let's let's play. Let's okay. play Cupid with this. Let's play ball. Let's play ball. This is, um, Wade. Wade. 
Wait, this yeah, is uh, Gladys. Yeah, I know uh, him. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know each other from where? Where the fuck did we meet at? PDM. Yeah, I think it was PDM. I still cars down there. I'm still waiting on you to buy a car. <laughs> a cl no. Miss, what you is your told name? Me, you told me my name. Is none of you I'm just kidding. I'm Gladys Barry. Gladys Barry, okay. Yeah, I do see a history of a rash here. Uh, where is the rash bothering you, ma'am? Uh, from my upper thigh, uh, to close to my genitalia. Upper thigh genitalia. No, close to the genitalia. Hopefully you can check that. I don't think it spread that far yet. Okay. Have you been doing lots of athletic activity in not so clean places? You can say something like that. Well, you're in luck. This person right here is looking to do some community service, and I am sure he'll be more than helpful. Uh. In applying no some offense. ointment creams and perhaps no offense. I know him because my grandma. I don't want him to see my vagina. Yeah, I don't oh. really want to look at my grandma's junk. Yeah. But it's for medical reasons. Since when did it's out of love. Cream? So here's the difference, Dr. Ma. I see him on the regular. I don't see y'all outside the hospital. So I'd like to keep it that way. Bit of uh, mm. doctor patient confidentiality within the, g the genitalia region is what she's looking for, Ma. If there was oh, anything yeah, else, yeah, yeah, yeah. even if it was on my big ass, I'd let him look on my titties, but not my genitalia, baby. Ah, fair not enough, my fair pussy. Good point. good point, good point. I mean, if you want to be so kind, I just do uh, anybody who comes to the front door, make sure to welcome them kindly and say, Welcome to Pillbox Medical Home. May assist you and see if you can just. Have not so much secretary, but just be a kind face to the front door. Maybe sweep up around the brushes and stuff like that, and then we'll we'll catch up with you once things slow down a bit. All right. Especially the elderly, Wade. Do help them. Yes. We didn't hear any of that. <laughs> didn't hear nothing. No, I didn't hear nothing. Didn't hear squat. It was oh, dramatic, right, though. Gladys, you'd be so kind to get up on the old bed. All right. All right, Gladys, Barry, Barry, there's lots here on your, your record here, Miss What's Barry. What's up there? Just about everything I've got. Jeez, gingivitis. Let me, actually, let me hear. Let me pull up the PAS. So I'll let you know. Yeah, I used to have gingivitis bad, you know. You know, <laughs> well, hot that water and pulling my teeth out and getting gingers really helps. Yes, fungal infections. Yeah, had gonorrhea. Got glaucoma says yeah, here. Yeah, I got glaucoma in both eyes. I smoke weed for that. Oh, that. Okay, yeah, I see. That's the remedy here in the prescription and I area. And I used that as an excuse before I started smoking too. Ha <laughs> ha, baby. Says you came in last week for excessive bad gas. Yeah. Dr. Ma, are you? Are you <laughs> I had Subway. Subway. Eat fresh. Eat fresh, they say. Hey, Boba. Uh, Dr. If you Mom. don't want to see my yes, vagina, yes. you might want right, to move. She got stabbed in the abdomen over at MRP. She needs immediate attention. <gasps> oh, shit. Okay. All right, am I getting up on that bed? God. Get with her first. Gladys, I'll be with you, my sweet old lady. Stab one to the abdomen. She's unconscious with a weak pulse. <laughs> Answering phone calls in the hospital. We have to get her on the bed immediately. Quickly. Quickly. Hey, come here. On the bed, please. Get, get her up. Don't worry, Gladys. See what I can do about that rash. Uh, we're out of this. Now. Oh, I know your sexy soft hands are gonna do the trick. <laughs> please, Gladys, please. I'm trying to work here. Oh, I'm enjoying it. Okay, let's see what we can do. Listen here, Gladys. I'm gonna go ahead and yeah, put an order for some creams here. Oh, yeah. However, Ma was almost a, a specialized in the uh, epidermal areas of the, the body, so he's gonna go ahead and take a look at that, okay? What does that mean, epidermal? The, 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 epi right? the epi epidermis, excuse me. All right, yeah, we're going to go ahead and see what we can do about these creams. I'm going to put an order in or run this up to the front. I'm going to have Ma take a closer look in case it's something else. We might have to take a sample. All right, but if you got to do an epidural, I'm down. <laughs> it will take a sample. It's going to hurt, but it should be short-lived. Nope. We're losing it. We're losing it. Okay, let's take a look here. Let's clean the excess blood. What's going on here, Ma? Jesus Christ! See if you can assess clean the excess blood around the wound. Cleaning blood!
Oh, this doesn't look good. More timers of the essence on this one. Indeed, yes. Checking for any major damage to any of the organs. Let's have a look-see here. Any damage? What do you see, Mark? Let's feel inside there. What do you see, Mark? I can't see all Up over the there. Up the sedatives, please. Up the sedatives. Up the sedatives. I'm, I'm looking. There's so much blood. I'm just trying to find out if there's any damage. Damn. It's always so hard to see past all the blood. She's trying to speak. She's making noises. Okay, it looks like there's no major damage here. All right. Damn. All right. Some, okay, we're gonna have to close this up now. Just suck out the excess blood from the inside. Then we're gonna stitch this thing up. Okay. Suction. I'm trying to. I'm trying to suction it all up. There's Hang so in much there, of my it. ICP extra. Please, officer, can I get some room here? I'm trying to operate. Oh, sorry, sorry. Christ sake, sorry. this woman's dying. I'm I'm apologize, apologize. It's on his iPad, like it's some sort of hotel lobby. Please. Okay. All right, stitching it shut now. Stitching. I just, said, I just need a little bit more to get to the next level. Gotta play. Gotta play. All right. We're gonna clean the surrounding area. All right, apply a bandage. Nope. Oh, she's nope. spitting it up. She's spitting it up. Whatever you're putting in there, she's spitting it up, Ma. It looks like there's some actual internal bleeding somewhere. Okay, it looks like something did get hit. All right, hold on one second here. We're opening it back up. Shit. Just when you think we're in the clear, they go spitting it all up. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's have a look see here. Okay, looks like there might be some damage here by the lungs. Okay, yep. Slight graze on the lower left lung. Let's see what we can do about getting that patched up. She's graying up. Losing yep. that pinky goodness. Let's make sure the fluids are going in nice and steady. It's getting cold. Right. Found the hole. I'm closing the hole now. Close it up. It's closed. Okay. All right, it's closed. Look at that. She's pinking up. She's getting pink. Closing main wound again. That's good. That's good, Maul. All right, she's oh. back. She's back. She's back. Shut up. That's, and that's and look, she's back. Yes. Okay, she's back. Okay. All right. All right. The bandage has been applied. It has been clean, and she's all yours, PD. Well done. And now I have to go wash Woo. my hand again. Wow, it's good shit. Dude. Well good done, Ma. Wow. Well done. Wowie. Yes. Done God's yes. work, Ma. God's work. It's like, it's like she's staring into my soul. So fucking creepy. All right, that's all yours. Wow. Unbelievable. I've never seen shit like that in my life. Unruly! What up, Kenny? Kenny, what up, man? We're doing some doctor stuff, dude. We're saving people's lives, damn it! Can't you see, unruly mob? Oh. I'm saving lives! Science be damned! Boink! Oh, uh, you know, um, I didn't get a, I didn't, didn't get a good look at the face. All right, I, uh, put an order in for the, uh, genital cream. Okay, yeah. These pants are on too tight. We're gonna have to rip them off. Take care of that. Hold on a second, please. All right. Oh boy. It's like looking in the sun. It's hard to look. Gladys, can you hear me? I don't care. Okay, good. I'm gonna go ahead and use the suture here to cut these jeans off. They're just too tight. We can't get them off with the team here. Just pull them. All right. Okay, yeah, that's smart. Yeah, I'll pull them down. These are JC Penney's collector's goddamn jeans from back in 1987. You ain't cutting these. No, 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 no. It's a close call, but no, we don't have to cut them. Okay. Taking a look at it here. Ma, what do you say? It's a bit flaky and red. It's itchy. Oh, does it itch? It does it itch only... It itches and burns. Does it itch only when you scratch it, or or does it itch on its own? It itches on its own, and it burns when I scratch it. Oh, damn, the both. That's not good. Uh, let's see, Ma. What do you what do you think that is, Ma? I mean, it's close to the genitals. Couldn't be herpes, could it? Well, I've seen well, herpes. That ain't look, herpes. You can look at it. Might have to Red take a sample. Flaky inner thigh. Could be herpes. I'm I'm telling you, Ma. There's been an excessive a amount of cases. May be accompanied by itchiness, losing lesions, and scaly patches. Atopic dermatitis, more commonly known as eczema, causes red, itchy, and dry skin. Oh. 
Oh. Thank you, Google. Well, it looks like it could be an eczema. Well, it's either the lifelong hey, horrible Google? disease known as herpes or just eczema. Hey, Google, order one large dildo from Amazon. Google, ignore that. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, it could be a type of eczema. All right, well, that's easily creamable. But do we take the risk? Uh, hold on. Allow me to do this, Ma. Uh, Gladys, you know, we got the whole uh, yeah. doctor-patient confidentiality. Have you been having a lot of unprotected, promiscuous sexual activities within your genital region? I mean, a woman is old as Well, you know, I'll be honest you with could you. could still be promiscuous. Yeah, Beverly's been beating my walls to pieces. Who's Beverly? Beverly? Uh, Beverly Malcolm. Do you trust this Beverly Malcolm, or have you been using protection? No, we haven't used protection, but he said he's clean. Oh, uh, well, saying and actually being are two very different things. Well, you know, you're making me scared. I don't mean to do that, Gladys. I only wish to make you healthy again. Now, if, uh, strange promiscuous sex is not at the, uh, if that's not the leading case, we can I'm start with the eczema that, creams, uh, and we can work our way from there. How about that, Gladys? You got this, Dr. Pepper? After yeah, I got this, yeah. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I got this one. So here, I'm gonna go ahead and give you this cream. This is for eczema. Okay. Now, you go ahead and you take this, and, uh... If it works, then cool. And if not, then come back. We'll work our way up the chain of horrible rashes. Okay. We'll start with eczema, work our way up to some kind of fungal itch. And, uh... Chuck. If that, you know, if it's just not getting any better, then uh, we'll, we'll shoot for herpes. Now, how long until I know the first cream works? Oh. Well, uh, it'll be about two weeks. You're gonna have to put it on twice a day at night uh, before you go to sleep, and then when you wake up after a shower. Does, does it smell? Uh, if you use too much, the trick is to not use too much of this stuff. It's got steroid stuff in it. You don't want you don't uh, want too much. Yeah, don't, I don't use want to too smell much. Smell like a goddamn deviled egg when I put my pants down. No, no, no. You don't want the deviled egg. No, no one wants that. So you just the trick no. is just use it a little bit. Just wet your whistle. And then, and then rub it down there, just a little bit, not too harsh. I see you flaking up down here. You got to be careful. All right, just a little bit, of, and I'm good. Yes, a little bit, of, and then that's that's all. We'll work our way up. Hopefully, it works. If it gets worse, okay. then we'll, we'll we'll troubleshoot from there. That's how these things work. Now, if you really want to make sure, I can take a skin sample. Well, I'm okay. Yeah, take a skin sample just in case it doesn't clear up. Might as well get it done now and wait two weeks. Come back, get a damn skin sample. That's the. Uh, I, I mean, I, I don't I, got insurance as it is. Y'all little cocksuckers order your charge of the arm and the leg. That's what I try to tell people. But see, a lot of people don't want to do the skin sample because it hurts. I ain't a bitch. Well, all right then. Let's get to work. All right, Glanis, uh, how do you do with pain? You got a high pain, pain tolerance? I, I would say so. I'm in the hospital more, multiple times a day, so I think I have a, a high pain tolerance. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and use this tool here. It's sort of like a cheese grater. Uh, I'm going to take a little piece of skin. Oh, that looks just like a cheese grater, for real. It is. It, yeah, it really does. So I'm going to go Someone's ahead. Someone's having craft at night. Oh, uh, yeah, so here's what we're going to do. I'm just going to take a little, little piece here. Now, if this stuff's hard for you to handle, you might want to look away. Maybe think about the weather, something like that. Or would you want, do you want it to be a surprise or you want to know when it's, when it's going down? Yeah, let me know when. Tell the three. Okay, wow. You really want to take this head on. All right, I'll let you know when it's going down, okay? I'm going to count you in on go. I'm going to, I'm going to take a little bit off like a... Like a deli meat yeah, cheese grater sort of thing I'm a, here. Ain't no bitch, ain't gonna hurt. All right, here we go. Just like the deli meats back at the grocery store way back when. Here we go. Three, two, get ready. One. There it is. There it is. Oh, it's tough. Oh, it's tough. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's a big chunk right there. Got it. Good. Oh, that's a sensitive area. I should have thought about that. All right. Uh, go ahead and, uh, well, here, I'll bandage it up. Uh, I'm going to put some alcohol on it. That's This is going to sting as well. A little alcohol. Make sure you don't get an infection. Right there. That's going to sting. That's, that should sting. <coughs> yeah. Okay. Now I'm just going to talk No, no, no. It's okay. No, no, no. Not you. <laughs> no, no, no. It's all right. Just doing my job here, ma'am. Now I'm going to go ahead and patch you up. There we go. 
should be fine. So now you have uh, that's it's quite gashy and bloody, and it's gonna heal. So just use this eczema cream, maybe around the around the perimeter of it, and uh, see if All that right. see if that heals the uh, outside perimeter of the genital wound, and uh, let it heal, and then we'll go from there. We'll troubleshoot from there. Sound good? That sounds good, Dr. Pepper. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put your folder here from the unhealthy pile to the healthy unless is there anything else bothering you no i think that's it all right i'm gonna go ahead and put you in the healthy pile should should feel good about yourself yeah, now i had really really bad diarrhea squirt for a little bit but i cut back on the hot dog and i just started drinking the water by itself and that helped out a lot yeah the uh hot dogs uh you can't really trust where they get the meat from for those do you know where you Getting that meat from? Well, no, that doesn't bother me. The fact is, there's so much of it, it just gushes up. And there's no hard suckness to it, so you gotta bend over and let out a tooth. Well, just like they taught me at DeVry. A little bit too much of anything's no good for you. Isn't that the online university? Yes. That's where I got my MD. Well, I figured you'd take, like, University of Phoenix or something. All right. Nope. Night classes. DeVry online. Damn, I need to start doing that. All right. Yep. It's so easy. Yeah, the commercials say it's so easy. It's so easy. Why aren't you doing it? You're sitting there. Why aren't you doing something about it? Well, I'm 62. Oh, no, I'm not talking to you. I was just reciting the commercial. Hi there. How can I help you? Hi. Um, just uh, if you could do me a favor. Um, just uh, in door voices. It echoes like hell. Should you put your pants back on? Oh, uh, yes. Sorry. Excuse me. No, no you're, you're fine. You're fine. I'm fine. Yeah, by the way. Uh, no, I'm just saying you're just uh, you're, you're fine as long as you 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 know indoor voices. Okay. Uh, now correct me if I'm wrong. Last I checked, the indoor voices only decrease the volume. It doesn't actually change the radius. Oh, hey, Mark, can it you confirm this? It changes the radius. Oh, change. Yeah, Is that a new not update? Not true. Because mm. uh, listen, I don't mean to you know get no, into no, you're, get you're into fine, it, but fine. I'm just trying to no, clarify here because a lot of people come in here yelling and screaming. People are too loud. From my understanding, we're all at a certain volume, but then when you talk in a quieter voice, all it does is lower your overall volume instead of the radius. Dr. Pepper, Dr. Pepper. Yes. It does change the radius. It's nothing to do with volume. You've well, been what the hell? Lie. Since when? Is this new? You've been living a lie. So please, if you could, you know, speak in indoor voices. Thank you. Like either a normal volume or a whisper. All right, y'all. I'll catch y'all later. I'll see y'all later. All right. Care, Gladys. Bye, bye, Gladys. She's hitting on you. I don't know what she's doing. Get some. But it's such rhythm. Wow. That Gladys. I shouldn't. Oh, hold on. Um. Wow. Can I help you over here, away from the window? Uh, yeah, Quite tall. There we go. Okay, right here. Right here. Okay. No, that's a women. All right, just a light ankle brace should do. Yeah, we should be fine here. Okay. All right. Wrap that nice and tight. Just make sure to keep that on for at least a good amount of time. Take it easy with those high heels, okay? Careful, Ma. Those heels are look like quite, quite delicate. Indeed. All right. How are we feeling? I feel much better. Thank you. You're welcome. I need to see your ID, please. There you go. It is oh, popping off. Appreciate that. All right. Well, if you need anything else, please let me know. There's also a man out right there with the blue shirt and black pants. He's giving out free hugs. Free hugs. All right. Who's next? Who's next? Uh, I guess I guess that would be be me. I, I fell off some railing in the motel, and, and my head really hurts right now. Really hurts. Oh, okay. We'll go ahead and get on the bed. Okay. Just a sec. <laughs> Oh, Came to oh. the right place. Oh, yeah. Well, I thought of going to the supermarket, but I thought that might be a bad choice. Sounds good for me. I'm actually starving to death. Hey, Ma, we got food over here? We got a lunchroom? Oh, 
I'll, I'll, oh yeah, hold on a second. I got some for you. That uh, do you mind if I stay here? It's so much better than the motel beds. I'm telling you, a lot of people have been coming in here trying to hog up all the AC. It's so gosh darn hot oh. out there. Unfortunately, we can't keep you here like a hotel. There you go. But you'll feel feel free to hang out in the lobby. Oh, thanks, Ma. The lobby's better than nothing, I guess. Mm. Tuna. Oh, looks like it just. Mm. Yeah, he just. I don't know. I just feel your head open a little bit there. Oh, right? the... oh wow. Well, wow, that looks bad. Oh, just tuna. Real bad. Are you? Are you yeah, eating? Tuna. Yeah, are you, tuna. Are you? Are you eating? Uh, are you? Tuna. Oh. Tuna sandwich. Can you stop spitting on me, please? Oh, sorry, excuse me. Oh, Thanks. Got rude of me. A few stitches, I'll take care of this one. Okay. Did I get tuna spit in my in my brain? It's mayonnaise. No, oh. no, 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 don't worry. Dr. Mills is a professional eater that when he spits up the excess, it always misses the wound. Oh, that's true. That's yep. just how good, good. He just hits everywhere else but the wound. That's right. Uh, ready oh, to work. How are you feeling, dear? Uh, a little better, yeah. No, that's that's good. I don't feel like I'm gonna pass out or anything. All right, well, let Dr. Pepper just assess you to make sure everything is fine. And if you need to top off, there's lemon water in the corner. Dr. Ma, take it away. Uh, Dr. All Pepper, right. take it away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks fine here. So he Did fell. You... Oh, your name is Dr. Pepper? That's cool. yes, just like, like the... this. Yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. Yes. You probably get that a lot. I'm yes, sorry. I do. Three times today, as a matter of fact. Oh, only three times? I think it'd be more than Only that. three times. Only been on my shift for about an hour. Wow. Mm -hmm. Dr. Like Pepper, this... like the beverage? There you go. Four times. Four times now. This is a, almost a world record at this pace. Who knows? By the end of my shift, I might have heard it 20 times. 20 times? Well, you're going to be around for a while, aren't you? No. So we better get to work. Yes, we'd better get to work. Now, let's see. These legs of yours, they took most of the fall? Oh, no, actually, I landed on my head. Your head? Oh, wow. Yeah, head first. Oh, the jeans are just sort of torn by design? Uh, yes, exact, exactly. Oh, I thought it was I mean, battle damage. No, it wasn't. It. Uh, these were at the airport, all right? So, I mean, I, I arrived here, and that's all they had. Okay. Uh, I don't typically like jeans like that. Okay, airport jeans. Noted. Airport jeans, yeah. Airport you, you jeans. Take what you can get. Yeah. You now, know, like was, was the hair always a rancid green? Um, or is that that no? That's the shampoo at the at the motel. It, uh, yeah, that was shampoo my Shampoo at the hotel, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't know much about that. Oh, um, yeah. I guess yep. you're Thanks. you're a doctor. You don't need to to really resort to a motel. Well, no, I'm 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 bald. Oh, oh, oh! Thanks, it's, oh I didn't want to point it out. So. Thanks, um, by the way. <clears throat> Doctor Pepper, it's five times. Yeah. So okay, hair dye checks out. Let's check these clavicles. Nice and sturdy, haven't broken. Usually that's the first thing to break. I always like to check those by default, but looks fine. I think you're ready to get up and uh, get up and make, uh, make like a leaf. And and leave? And leave. Oh, leaf and leaf. All right. Oh, I, I, don't mind my shoes. We don't like when people squat on the bed, the dirty shoes oh, and all. I apologize. Huh? Gotta go. Inside voice. What's up? Can you please use your inside? Oh, jeez. Sorry. Yeah. I just get so passionate about medicine. Oh, there we go. Whew. I just was really attached to that bed, apparently. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to leave. No problem. Uh, Excuse me, doctor. Did you, uh... Did you know that, um... His name is Dr. Pepper, like the beverage? There's the six uh, times. Yeah, yes, he knows. He's one of my old friends and colleagues. We've known each other for years. Uh, I'm just trying to get him up to his, his quota of 20 times, so uh, I'll tell people. Yes, I'll, yes, I know. Uh, 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 maybe do a test jump to see that your legs are working correctly. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Wonderful. Oh, Looks oh, great. Sorry about that. Oh, Hopefully oh, we don't see you too soon now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Nice person. Uh, in her right arm. Apparently it's been growing over time to the point at which she can't even pick up a pen anymore. Uh, Sir, I can't write my name anymore. Or do my uh, shopping list or write poems to my stalkers. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's a damn shame, isn't it? Uh, we tried moving her arm around a little bit, but she moved the wrong arm, so there might be a little bit of dementia. But uh, looks, there was, I'm going to apply it. I'm going to give oh her a God, spring. Oh, my God, is that dying? Am I dying? What's dementia? Is she dying? No, 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 you're not dying, my dear. I'm maybe dying. a little bit. You maybe a little dying. Maybe some brain cells, but not so much yourself. But, uh... Nope, you're she fine, looks good. Dear, she doesn't look like she's dying. No, she looks 
Yeah, it still looks fine to me. Maybe a little bit on the inside, but nothing else beyond that. Let's put that hand in the splint, okay? Are you ready? Uh-huh. Now, what I want okay. to do, this is very important. Uh-huh. I need you to take it real easy with that arm for a while, okay? Uh-huh. All right, and if it doesn't get any better, come back into the hospital immediately for further assessment, all right? I mean, am I allowed to use it at all? I'd be careful. I'd be careful. I'd be That's very all. careful. That's all. That's all we can tell you. Like, we can really? worth of groceries. Maybe like two oranges and a pack of gum. That's about as much as you can get. Oh, two oranges and a pack of gum. I don't like oranges. What about mangoes? One mango. And that's One it. Mango? Anymore, and it's two. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. uh, it, Got to expand your fruit horizons. Gum. That's right. There's lots of and flavors out there. Juicy uh, fruit, that's a good one. Oh, Are you ready? Juicy fruit. Twenty-three. Okay, to be exact. Now. I didn't. Feel, I felt her up a little bit there, and she's got no fracture, stuff like that. There seems to be nothing out of place, so it's a little strange. Uh, oh. Her pulse is fine, so it's nothing to do with the regular heartbeat. So we're just going to put this thing in the in the, in the splint here and see if uh, it heals itself over time. But if it has any further issues, please come back immediately, okay? Uh huh. Like it's not going to fall off or anything, right? Science helps no, us. It doesn't. Fine. Then may science okay. have mercy on all of us. I mean, will super glue work? I mean, I carry some of that. You know, because I like the smell. What? I, I didn't, I didn't catch that. that. I didn't catch it. What? <laughs> I mean, if I just glue it back on with super glue. Super glue. Super glue. We don't, uh -huh. we don't really like to recommend people go ahead and start super gluing their wounds. Usually save that for the trained professionals. Well, I mean, on the packet it says you can glue anything they back together. Packet of what? Well, right. On the back, She's on the back of the packet of the, if you want to the finish up, I'm going to go check the fun room, okay? All right, Ma. Sorry, what? Package? On the back of the packet of the super glue, it says you can super glue anything together. Yes, just no. because you can doesn't mean you should. Well, I mean... I mean, why not? I mean, if I can, I should, right? No, you shouldn't. I'm telling you right now as a medical professional, you should not. What you should do is come on in here. We'll patch you up. Looks like Ma oh, took ca good care of you here. Why do you want to go and take a glue gun, shove it up your... Where are you hurting? Um, on my chest. And then my, like, arms got numb and I could barely move them. I couldn't even pick up a pencil. Listen, ma'am, don't go super glue in your chesticles, all right? Leave it to the medical my professionals. Chesticles? Wait, yes. What? I got chesticles? Have it's, I got it's the, on me Sorry, it's the medical oh. term for the chest. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it's the chesticles? Yes. Uh, medical professionals, usually it's that kind of lingo. I wouldn't go around saying it yourself. Anyways, looks like Ma went ahead and patched you up fine here. Check this. Looks good. Poke oh. this. Looks great. Ow. Ow. It's Ow. Cold. Too soft. No, 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 not dying here. No, no, no. Check this out. Reading your vitals right now on the the beep boop. Uh, you can make a call. There's no signal in here though. Well, I mean, I can't move my hands, so I can't call my mom. Oh, I'm sure you can. Here, just let me help you up. Okay. I think you're fine. Once you get up, the blood will come rushing back where it's supposed to be. Get out of there. Get the blood out the chesticles. All right. You ready to stand up? Oh, um, him, I'll try. All right. Let's get you up. Three, two. See if you can get up. See if you can get up. Yeah. I can't. Oh. I can't get up. Oh, no. You can't get up, I, really? I Just feel like I need a magic touch from the other doctor. I feel like I'm paralyzed. I'm paralyzed. Might be chesticular torsion are you having a hard time breathing um hang on <sighs> sounds fine air's going in air's yeah. coming out yeah. yeah i feel fine yeah just don't force it so hard just like <sighs> naturally yeah. like that nice and healthy hear my lungs this. listen this is mine uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <sighs> see how healthy that sounds yeah, yours doesn't sound healthy. 
Yeah, you need to you, try it my way. Unhealthy. No, no, no. I mean, just I don't even smoke. No, just try it my way. Your way. <sighs> no blockage, nothing. Iron lungs. <sighs> now you're not even trying. What do you mean? I was trying. You said to do it your way. I did it your way. Just here. I'll put my hand on your forehead. Just breathe. Forehead. Put your hand. I'll put my hand on your forehead. Just breathe. Forehead. Uh -huh. My forehead doesn't breathe, but my mouth does. Your forehead? No, I'm holding it back so you can... Okay, no hands. Now breathe. <sighs> there, that sounds a lot better. I think you're ready to get up and get on out of here. Yeah, nah. I still need, like, the other doctor to give me a special touch or something. Okay, I okay. I, I, see, I see. Okay, okay. I, I see what's going on here. I see what's going on here. You want more? I'll get more. Sounds like a squeaking dog. I'll wait. He's monologuing again. I didn't even get the monologue yet. But Ma! Oh yeah, patients need him, patients want him. I'll wait. I'll wait. Ma monologuing. <clears throat> so I know you want I know you want Ma, but he's he's monologuing right now. No, he's deep in his thoughts, his head, his memories, his memoirs are all sort of playing in his own head like a movie and he's getting sentimental towards himself about the whole past of his oh. experiences wow. and so forth. Does that mean if he's getting sentimental towards himself, he's going to have a moment with himself? Yeah, that's precisely what he's doing. He likes to do it while he looks out the window. Oh, should he really be doing that in public in a hospital? There could be children watching. Well, there's a certain patient doctor confidentiality thing going on so i guess we're not allowed to really talk about it oh yeah i do it but sometimes what? too oh yep oh uh remind me not to go watch up look out the window right then now. surprised you guys can even see out of it anymore i mean i don't need a window i could do it right here right now oh um can, okay M maybe not no, I'll do, what, here, yeah. you know what? I see it appears as though you have some sort of misunderstanding. I'll go ahead and monologue. I'll just look a little oh. bit off of your bed and just... Uh -huh. Actually, I'll, yeah, I'll position myself this way and I'll sort of monologue and you can kind of see what it's all about, but... Oh, uh, do you have that look on your face where you smell the bad fart? Is that the look? Is that what you do? Well, you see, times like this, it takes me back. I remember... As if it was yesterday, I was flown out at the base of Mount Everest. A man was brave enough, thought he could conquer the whole entire mountain climb by himself, but he was wrong. They called me out. It was the top of my class. I was the only one nearby that could get there in time. And when I arrived, he was frozen, solid like Han Solo. And I thought, uh, how are we supposed to fix this? Should we, should we put a fire, put him near a fire and watch him melt? I said, no. It's just like chicken. Cool running water. Cool running water. Cool running water. I was able to thaw the man. After about three hours of running cool water over his frozen body, he arose, started speaking again. Although it wasn't perfect English, he had to learn. And he, I, I taught him step by step how to walk again. Uh, and it was through that process that yeah. I was able to thaw his entire body, and bring him back to perfect health. I learned a very wait, valuable wait, lesson that day. Him. Sorry, what? Oh, hi, Ma. Man, oh, sorry, I didn't. I, uh, uh, sorry, I was monologuing as well. Continue. Oh, did you have something to say, ma'am? Oh, I was just saying, did you freeze him? I mean, you just said you just, just defrosted him. No. I defrosted him. Thawed him. 
Like I said, when people try to climb Mount Everest, they think it's all easy peasy. Next thing you know, they're frozen solid, just like Han Solo. People were gonna use a fireplace to warm him and thaw him out, but that would have killed him. It would have been too much for the heart. But it was my idea to run cool water over his body for a period of about three hours straight that he was able to thaw and become human. Yet again, he arose like the dead. <laughs> I think about him often. The base of Mount Everest. The way he walked away. It's not me. No. It's science. Just like thawing out a chicken breast. Science. Um. <clears throat> if you'll excuse okay. me. Uh. That was beautiful. Like a big chicken. <laughs> Poor bastard. Get it together. Get it together, Pepper. These people's lives are on the line. Don't go getting sentimental now. Not in front of them all. Not like this. Doctor. That's my name. Don't wear it out. I, uh, I fucked up. I got in a car accident and my left pinky and my mouth hurts. Oh, well, let's uh, go ahead and bring you on in and let's take a look at that pinky right this way. We got beds all around. Take your pick. All right. So your pinky and uh, what else? Uh, my mouth. All right. Well, go ahead and lay down here. All right. Ugh. Pinky and your mouth. Usually the mouth stuff go to the dentist, but we're willing to bend with the rules here. Now, what was it that oh. went in your mouth? Oh, I think my steering wheel. Oh, one of those drivers. Yeah. All right, let's see what we can do here. Oh, yeah. Your lips look all red. You bite down on the oh. lip. Just a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, I got that problem too. Guess what? I woke up. I had a canker sore. Ooh. Yeah, it sucks. You get those? Yeah, those aren't good. Yeah, I had a Reese's Pieces. Went and saw that Spider-Man movie. Yeah. And uh, I knew I was going to pay for it. I knew it, but I did it anyways. It happens every time. You should, see the, you should see the size of the suckers I get. Huge canker sores. Ooh, size of a dime. They suck. Size of a dime. I got a big gaping hole in my mouth. But guess what? What? No cure. Yep. No, what you, no, what cure. no cure. No cure. Dude, so what do you do? You suffer through it, damn it. I've had them since I was a kid. They oh, suck. Shit. Yeah, good. God, I just hear an explosion outside. Yeah. All right, let's see here. Back to the mission at hand. Right, okay. Uh, here, I'm going to go ahead and numb your mouth a little bit. All right. All right, because I like to shove the stick way in there. Now say, ah. Oh. Deeper. Deeper. Oh. Louder, ah. Oh. Okay, vocal cords are fine. That's enough. So you didn't damage your voice. Uh, let's see. Let's take a look at that pinky. Yeah, the pinky's a bit bruised. Oh. Yeah, pinky's bruised big time. Julio! Oh, hey. I'm sorry, you two know each other? Yeah, I know her. Uh -huh. Okay, usually we don't let people just sort of cross cross visit beds, but I guess if you're friends. Um, hold on. Oh, I mean, is it because I'm going to bring my disease over here or something? Did Ma say you have a disease? No. Well, then you don't have a disease. Well, I mean, why would I cross contaminate my, uh, my cross over? All I'm saying is I've got a stick in this guy's mouth. I'm about to take a look at his pinky. I don't know if he's cool with you watching the whole thing go down. No, it's fine. Okay, he says it's cool. The more the merrier. Can you make it hurt? Make it no. what? Can make it hurt. Make it what? Hurt. Make it hurt? Yeah, hurt. 
No, this is a how this is a place of medicine, a place of healing. I'm not here to hurt him. You keep that up, I might have to kick you out. Might be the first one of the day. I mean, why would you kick me out for? Listen, uh, let me work. That's all. All right. Now, where was I? Ah, oh, yes, the pinky. Yes, it's quite uh, bruised. Slammed it uh, on the wheel, huh? Yeah, I mean, it got caught on the wheel. Yeah. Well, I stubbed my toe yeah. this morning. Guess what? What? No what? cure. No cure. No cure. So, what, did you just like tape it? Nope. You just gotta tough it out. Uh, is that what I got to do with my pinky as well? Just got to tough it out. Looks like it. Uh, it doesn't look like a hairline fracture. Does this hurt? No. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. I stand corrected. Could be a hairline fracture. Definitely not more than a regular fracture. But still no cure for the stub toe. Damn. What was your name, sir? Julio Thomas. Julio... Thomas. Thomas, I'm gonna yeah, go ahead and yeah. put your file here from the healthy pile into the unhealthy pile. Do you understand? Do you understand? Oh, fuck. All right. I'm sorry that that's how it's gonna have to go. Now, as far as your mouth, uh, looks fine. Uh, a bit bruising on the lip, but I'd say if there was a contest, I'm winning in terms of pain with the canker sore and stub toe. No oh, shit. Yeah, but you don't see me in a bed. I'm working. You just gotta tough it out. Gotta tough it out, Ma. This guy's got a bad, uh, bad pinky, and uh, he bit his lip. Bad pinky, and he bit his lip. Yeah. What the fuck nah. are you doing? I got in a car accident. Car accident, oh, Ma. Accident. Let's have yeah, a look I just see here. Just slammed my mouth into my fucking steering wheel. Okay, let's have a look here. Look at that lip. Yeah, lips Ooh, bad. Oh, you bit down good. You really bit that lip. Oh my yeah. goodness. Ma, are you Google talking to Ma? Are you, are you talking to me or him? Him? him, him Just him, take a look him. at this, Ma. Look at my mouth. Uh, okay. See this? Right. That's yeah. a canker sore. You see that? Uh, oh God, that's fucking disgusting. Ooh, look! Look at that big old mouth. There. Size of a doing? dime. Were you eating an excessive amount of peanuts again? No, for me it's chocolate. Reese's chocolate? Pieces peanut butter cup. So delicious and so fucking tempting. But so I knew I'd get them all. I knew it, but I did it anyways. Oh, sir. Okay. Oh. Siren song. All right. Well, looks like you're going to need some stitches on that lip, okay? All right. All right. Here, yeah, let's see. All right. I got a little bit of a freezing agent I'm going to inject into your lip, okay? All right. This will help numb the area while we go in for stitches, all right? I might take some of that for the road, Ma. Oh. All right. Yeah, I can get you a spare one. Okay, let's see here. All right, here comes the needle. Okay. Oh. All right, Dr. Pepper, if you'd go ahead and assist me with the stitching, please. All right, on my way. My friend, you're about to experience the most elegant stitching you've ever oh, had there in your go. entire life. All right. Second one of the day. Let's see if we can get a two for two here. All right, here we go. Going in for the stitches. A oh. little bit of alcohol rinse. Go ahead and spit that out. Sorry, that probably burns, huh? Just a little bit. All right, here we go. Using the 20 gauge needle here. That's a big one. All right. Take care of the lip. I'm going it's to like brace the size that of a pinky into a brace here. Okay. All right. Just gonna go ahead. And, gonna go ahead and Ooh. patch this up here. There we go. Ooh. And got it. Looks good. Here, I'll give you a put a little, yeah, I'll put a little, nice. yeah, put a little cotton oh, ball. Yeah, it's, it's going to be swollen for a little bit. It's going to be really hard to speak for a little while. So I hope you don't mind. We'll give you some ice pack here to help with the, help eliminate the swelling as much as possible. But you're going to be a little for a while. Oh, I'm bring it here. Oh, yeah, you're going to have a little cotton ball in there. I'll probably chew on that for a while. Should help with the pain. And looks good. Cleaning it up. Sorry, I got a little bit on your shirt there. It's a nice shirt. Oh, it's okay. Sorry about that. Okay, pinky's in a brace. Okay, the pinky should be good to go. How's the lip looking? It's good. All patched up. We'll have to all wait right, for that one to heal. Oh, no! And remember, Julio, stay away from those goddamn Reese's Pieces. Don't let them get to you. But I love peanut butter cups. It's not worth it. Damn That's it. what I said. It. Damn it, but look at me. Oh, fuck. Look at my right. lip. All right, Julio, you ready to try standing up? Oh, I'm good to go. All right. 
There he goes. Working his way through the through the ether. Covers. There he is. There we go. Oh, thanks, dogs. Looking good, Julio. Looking good. Looking I'm, I'm, good. I'm gonna go ahead and put your name in the healthy pile. All right. Oh, can yeah. I can I get your ID, Julio? Oh, of course. There you go. Thanks, Julio. Thank you, Julio. Oh, thank you. Ignore the part. It says I'm a female. It says female here, Julio. We don't judge, Julio. We don't judge. Okay, Julio Thomas. All right, thank you. Uh, Bell, appreciate that. Oh, Born in 94, huh? Yeah. Zoom, zoom. <laughs> zoom, zoom. All right, well, uh, you are free to go. Take it easy on that pinky, okay? No diabolical thinking. It'll hurt when you put it towards your mouth. It's double the pain. All right. All right, thanks, Doc. Come on, little bitch. Let's get... <laughs> oh. That's B fly. That was B fly. Yeah. Miracle wow. work is always, Dr. Pepper. Miracle work is always. Just doing our best. Just doing we our talking best. Talking about de thawing someone and then you trailed off. Just a monologue, Ma. Just another monologue of a man I saved was flown out. Thought a man alive. Saved him. Wasn't easy, though. Seeing him like that. It's like Han Solo. It's like carbon, just totally frozen. The people at the bottom of the mountain thought they could just use a fire. But it would have been too much for his heart. And you know what they say, Ma. Ain't nothing you can do about a broken heart. Hell no. Ain't no mountain high enough. Ain't no... I don't know the words. Valley. I believe it's a valley. A broken heart. A valley heart. long enough. Trust me, Ma. I know all too well about a broken heart. It reminds me. You know, Ma, I was once a married man. I don't know if you knew that about me. I didn't. She was a patient of mine. She came in, heavy breathing. She weighed 500 pounds. It took seven men to bring her in. But you know what I saw? A lot of people saw a sickly woman, ready to, ready to throw in the towel on life. But you know what I saw, Ma? What'd you see? A fixer-upper, just like my uncle's Ford. Thought I could fix her up. Try as I might. Just kept eating. Just kept eating and eating. Eating and eating and eating and eating. God damn it, Moss. Just kept eating. First was 300, then it was 400, 500. It's approaching 530, Ma. It's okay. It's okay. Let it, let it out. Let it out. I did what I could. It wasn't enough, damn it. And I await the day. When modern science finds some sort of solution for obsessive eating. But until then, canker sores and obesity, to hell with them both! You hear me, Ma? To fucking to hell, hell with, with both of them! To hell with them! Did you ever thought about maybe stapling her stomach? Tried everything. She ate through it. Got to the point where did lipo? We caught her. We caught her eating it, Ma. Putting it right back in. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Guess that's what I said. Unbelievable. What about Diet Pepsi? Everyone knows the cure for fat and boost obesity is Diet Pepsi. It's too far along, Ma. The diets, it wasn't even an option. She was classified dead as a BBW, approximately. Four years ago. I am so terribly sorry. Think about her all the time, Ma. Her name was Jennifer. She died thick. But she left a thick, cloggy part in your heart. Remember that. Remember the moments you had with her and her voluptuousness. Keep those moments tight. Like a well-used beanbag chair. I try, Ma. I try. 
Now, uh, we got, oh wow, we got no patients coming in. Wow, this has been a while since I monologued, turned around, and then we had an empty house. Holy shit, we better go check, make sure everything's okay. <laughs> you should also get some food. Oh, gift shop. Still haven't had a chance to see what's in the old gift shop. E. Must e. be closed. <laughs> gift shop must be closed. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, and the boat's right there. And the what? Wait. Uh, what? Someone dropped the atom on us. Perfect. Why are you saying this? God! <laughs> yeah. Ma, we should really get a window on the other side of the operating room. No shit. Hold on, I got an idea. Follow uh, me. If you go next to it, there's also a what do we do? Car. Do we call the cops? Oh my yes. <laughs> Good God! Yeah, um... I don't know if you see the ones that I see, but there's lots and lots of ghost cars now. I see a lot of cars. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. But the old big year blimp, that's a new one. That, my friends, is a new one. <laughs> no injuries though, huh? No, nope. a, a, a single injury at all. No and pilot? Even a... Yeah, no, nothing in uh, there. Uh, nope, nothing. Let me see wow. if there's a pilot. A little Hindi. A little Hindi burger. <laughs> Hindi burger. <laughs> Perhaps someone little should Hindi burger. the damn thing. <laughs> Are you mad? A little Hindi burger. Punk. I used to fly blimp in the Careful, Ma, remember the Hindenburg? We're block traffic to the hospital. We have to make sure that EMT can get here. <laughs> Ma, you don't know how to pilot one of these things, do you? I will very impress you here. I... Hold on. Can you get in? <laughs> I don't know if I want <laughs> I'm scared it's going to blow I I up. I want to see here. It's the key. See, there's the door handle on these. all wrong. Yeah, it's all wrong. Must have broke on its fall. Can't even get in the darn thing. Oh. Nope. Nope. I'm trying. Who knows? Well, we're getting you know, some I calls think, in. I think these things are full of gas. Soon. Yeah, I better clear the area. I might blow up. Oh, jeez. About fucking time! <laughs> Cross! Just tow the blimp. Say, Ma, you wouldn't happen to have any food on you. They got no lunch room. Oh, shit. Yeah, maybe... Well, it's slow. Maybe we should go get some lunch. Oh, yeah, you got a, you got a ride? Uh, no, I don't. Well, have to walk. You don't have a... All right. Doesn't have a car. Wow. No, hold on a second. No, we got, we got the guy who's assisting us. Hold on. What about the Wait. elderly? Uh, excuse me. Elderly fella. I have a drink for you if you like. Well, what do you got? What's your what's your bank number? One five two. Heavy uh, arm. Food. Thank you, heavy arm. We have food and Bod water, gang. sandwiches and sandwiches and water balls if we can. Keep the change as well. Yep, no problem. I'll go get you a bunch of torpedoes and sandwiches and waters and all right. Oh, greatly appreciated. Thank you. If you do stop along Any a hot? burger shot along the way, it would be nice. Just saying. Just putting it out there. You don't have to, but heart stoppers heart are pretty stopper? cool. Sure. I could go get a couple of heart stoppers. Any fries or anything? Yes, Curly. All right. All right. All right. And uh, so I'll also get the... Uh, they should have the uh, the shake there. The Stroop waffle. Limited time only. I'll get one of those. Ooh, second, I want one. If uh, if they have it, it, I know the franchise stores are a little different. Oh, god damn, I hope they didn't get rid of it already. You know, they come and go so quick. I was just getting used to my Stroop waffle end of the week. Yeah, well, you know, I mean, you know how them, you know, they, they, they get you hooked on it. You know, yeah, like they that, do. That they also give you canker sores. But it's uh, worth it. 
Yeah, if you say so, Doc. All right, I'll go get you a bunch of food. I'll be back. Appreciate it. Thanks, Wade. Yep, yep, yep. Good kid. Good kid. Yep. Low on uh, receptionists these days, huh, Ma? Yeah, it's a little slower than usual, yeah. Slow. That's a new one. Not the normal round here, that's for sure. Was this one of them bonsais? Mm-hmm. Poor fella's not getting any light. <laughs> no light. Partly wiltering and absolutely useless. I named the plant Brenda. Ah. Who's Brenda? Oh, oh wait. Worth explaining. I think I remember her. Was brief, but I remember. Gosh, these files. Oh man, look at this. We're all out of unhealthy pile people. All healthy piles today. That's that's a new one. Concerning, really. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you this. I'll, I'll tell you this, Mom. Quit doing crime? I don't know. I don't know what's gotten in. Maybe they're getting into other things. Um, so just eating crack rocks and promiscuous sex. You know, I'm worried about that Gladys lady. Well, what, 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 what's wrong? What do you think? Was it? Well, did I, you find out what it was? I went with the old uh, Statue of Liberty play and went all in on eczema and uh, told her to use the creams. But I also said we can go ahead and take a, a skin sample and send it over to dermatology. And they'll come back and they'll let it know in about a week or so what it, when it ends up being. But God forbid it's herpes. That's all it is, Ma, in this day and age. It's either eczema or herpes. No in between. Zero to a hundred, real quick. Real quick. Hey, Ma. Well, hopefully that it is the eczema. If you ever find a uh, cure for canker sores, go ahead and let me know. Be, let me be the first one to know, huh? Well, let's have a look. See, I'll open up again. It hurts, Ma. All right, fine. Let's have a look. Ah, it's right there. You see it? The bottom lip. See it? Right there on the bottom lip. That is a severe mouth herpes. That is one of the largest mouth herpes I've ever seen. No, no, no. Don't call it that. Well, that's what it is. It's a I know herpes. that's what it is technically, Ma, but there's no need to scare people. Well, are you okay. not a doctor? You're going to call by its proper terminal? Oh, yeah, God forbid second. I want to share a soda with okay, someone. I'll be looking at your mouth herpes in a second. One second. How can I help you, ma'am? Um, I uh, just actually wanted to check with Dr. Pepper and see what he's up for his quota there. Dr. Pepper? Oh, Dr. Pepper. excuse me. My ears are burning. Dr. Pepper? Dr. Pepper? Dr. Pepper? Someone call? Dr. Pepper? Um, just checking on your quota. Did my friend April come in? Make the reference? Sorry, I don't know of an April. Shit. All right, um, are you still up to six? Yeah, uh, matter of fact, it hasn't changed since you left. <sighs> Fuck. All right, excuse my language. I'll, uh, I'll work on that. Okay. All right, doctors, fight amongst yourselves. Lunchtime. Ooh, lunchtime. Hmm. What do we got? What's on the menu? Ma, you can go ahead and go first. There you I'm not go. picky. Bunch of heart stoppers, torpedoes, and some. Just don't waters. take all the heart stoppers, huh, Ma? <laughs> hey, they got the Stroop waffle? No, sorry, Doc, they was out of it. God damn! Right when I you even want asked it. If they had any left, any anything left over in the bag. They said, nope, they'd been sucked dry by some, uh, all right, okay. gal. God damn it. All the fatties out here having all the fun, huh? Ooh. I guess there was some food critic or something. They said that they ate almost everything that they had in there. <laughs> some fat guy came and ate all the food. Some fat guy, you say? Uh, woman. Oh, woman. <sighs> yeah, one too sure. Uh, they watched her eat like five hot stoppers and were really surprised that she stood up and walked out. Yeah, I don't know how it could have been. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, you eat five. I mean, I have a hard time just eating one. I haven't seen too many fatties come in today. Uh, you know, maybe it took a minute for it to work on her, you know. 
got to work through the you know all the, the the thick veins and stuff. Man, these are good. These heart stoppers. Hey, you might want to pace yourself there, Doc. No time. <laughs> you don't learn in time, Wade. This medical stuff ain't all, ain't all worked up to be. Sure, it's unhealthy, but the human body can withstand quite a beating. Oh, oh, uh, oh yeah, that's I, good. I know. I've, I've been flung from vehicles many a time. It seems to be happening a lot lately. Well, it's flying through vehicles. Oh, yeah. A lot of shit's been hitting the metaphorical fan today. Yeah, back. we need a nice good tsunami to come through. Hey, really? fucking man, hey, fucking man. Well, if you look at something to do, we can maybe get rid of some of these vehicles out front. Bloody hell. That I, blimp I still out there? Power. I really wish I could fly that thing. That'd be so cool. Yeah, we gotta make sure it clears the way so people can get to the hall. Well, nope, still out there. Oh, look, it uh, moved. In my, in my eyes, it's gone. Oh, no, it's, oh, there it goes. it's still there. It moved a bit. Oh, no. Someone's towing it. Thank God. Uh, with that? You'll be surprised. They're going to need Have some ropes. Met? Have you ever met Jordan Steele? No. He towed a tugboat. He towed a tugboat once right down main town. Towed a boat. He holds, he holds the world record for most tows in a single hour. Jordan Steele. Wow. Yeah, never heard of him. I, I, yeah. Is he going to fly that thing like a kite all the way to the impound lot? He also holds the record for getting his ass beat the most times. That's true. One day. You should see you should see his medical record. Yeah, I'll have to see that. He's been stabbed so many oh, times that he's been conditioned with lead poisoning. It's moving, look, there it goes. The atomic tire and rubber products. I'll be <laughs> Yeah, just wait till he tries to take that off. Boom. Oh, so that's just totally totaled somebody's car. They're gonna have a bad day. Those field with helium? Yeah. So what do you think's inside that thing? Helium? Mm, I want to say hot air. Just hot air, huh? Uh, I would, I would assume. We had a few patients today that looked like they were filled with hot air. Ha 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 <laughs> wow. Went real busy during the day, real slow at night. That's what they're uh, Give it a little bit. Oh, hello. <laughs> How you doing, ma'am? You, you, are you alright? Mm, I'm afraid I'm not. I'm feeling a little woozy. Oh, let's have a look at you. We don't even need to go inside for this. Let's see mm here. -hmm. Uh, what seems to be the problem? Bit of a wobbly walk. Yes. Um. <laughs> Stand still. Stand still, mm -hmm. ma'am. Right here. Bowling. Come on, Ma. You know it's not proper etiquette to operate out here in the streets. We're not operating. We're just having a look at mm her. -hmm. The Steve actually even needs to come in the hospital. So what's mm -hmm. what seems to be the issue? Oh. Um. Oh, I'm Can just go? feeling up, awful. Awful. I just, yes, yes, I've been getting headaches and, um, feeling a little nauseous. Uh, headaches in the front or headaches in the back? Mmm, in my temple. Oh, on the sides. Yes. Could you remove your glasses, please? Of course. Uh, look at me, please. I just want to see you. All right, just look left and right. Just looking for dilation or anything you all. You got a flashlight, Ma? I don't need a flashlight. Left mine inside. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> Raw dogging it. Okay. Raw dogging mm. it on the street, huh, Ma? That's how we're doing it. Just like the old days. <laughs> All right, come on in, ma'am. Looks like we're going to have heavy on the bed. That gotta blimp's going to fall. Something critical. <laughs> it's going to fall into the freeway. Dun, 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 Wade, do you see the blimp? Uh, oh, no, it's, I, I, it's falling I into eyes. the freeway. Oh dear! In my eyes, it is falling into the freeway. 
Oh, that's gonna kill some people. Oh, I love this city. It never gets old. Never gets never a dull moment, Wade. Never a dull moment. Nope. You'll learn. No, especially around here. Usually it's you know, it comes in waves. Mm-hmm. Comes in blimps. Hot air. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming hot air. I mean, that, that's the only thing I could think of. Is, I mean, right, it's not hydrogen. You really wouldn't want something like that filled with helium going off. I mean, yeah, that'd pretty be big bad. Fireball. Let's see what's going on here. Have you been drinking lots of water? Oh, yes. What's the color of your urine, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, a light shade of yellow. Light shade of yellow, okay. Well, it sounds like you're hydrated, so that's nothing to do with that. Have you ever had uh, frequent migraines in the past? No. No? This just, this just started happening for a week now? Yes. Interesting, interesting. I mean, maybe a little bit in the past, whenever, um... Can I see your ID, man? Yes, of course. Oh, What's dear. What's the name, Ma? I'm afraid Ma? that someone may have taken my ID. I can't find it on me. Oh, oh that's fine, dear. How old are you, ma'am? I'm 30. 30? Okay, you're not lying to me, are you? I mean, there's many women that come in here mm. saying, you know, X, and then they're and really Y. I'm lying, I mean, I'd say Don't 25. lie to a doctor. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Look at Ma. You're flirting. You dog. You dog. I was off the two-step recently. Hmm, well, I'm afraid I don't know what you're talking about. Your sex life. No. <laughs> uh, I'll uh, let I'm you take this one, Ma. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Uh, take <clears throat> one. It's really, um, been a while. Been a while? Define a while. A week? Uh, if it's being a doctor. Get to play with the chesticles before anyone else. Oh, I missed. All right, get, there you go. You should be able to get right up there. There you go, thanks. It says he took a news van to the head, Doc. News right van to, to the head. head. All right, let's see what we can do. Thank All right. You. Name? Name's Don. 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 Last... Todd? Don. Is it like a T-D-O-D? Don. John? Don. Don. John? Don. Oh, okay, I'll, I'll I'll guess. Last name? Fernbrook. Fudrock? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. We got two doctors in there. There you go, Evan. Thank you. Ah, uh, Don Fudrock. I love Fudruckers. Yeah, okay. Alright. Fernbrook. Alright, said you fell on your head? No, I took a news van to the head. News van to the head? Directly, in full forehead. You must be uh quite newsworthy. <laughs> uh, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and plug, plug you into the beep boop machine here. <clears throat> Let's see what okay. we can do. Just gonna run some vitals. Make sure you, uh, but you're aware of where you are. You know where you are? Yes. Do you know where yes. you are? Where I'm are you, sir? The hospital. Hospital. Which one? Pillbox. Do you know what city you're in? Yeah, Los Santos. The state? Not... Sir? Oh, God. Do you know what's... Sir? Sir? Sir, are you okay? Sir? Just flatline. Oh no! Good God, I think he's flatlining. Sir, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. Okay, thought I'd lost you for a second. It appears as though you're a little woozy. Yeah, unaware yeah, that yeah, you're I'm in. Woozy. Unaware that you're in the state of San Andreas. I'm gonna go ahead. And, I'm gonna go ahead and put some pressure here. How's that feel? Does that hurt? Or in your clavicle? Yeah, no, no, it's mainly my head. Okay, uh, Ma, this guy got hit by by a news news truck. To the head. On his Talk head. about a headliner. That... <laughs> oh, that was <laughs> that was a better one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's wrap this up. Okay, let's, let's just take care of the wound here. Let's see. Uh, what do you see, Doctor Pepper? Well, he d he's unaware of where he is, so his memory might be jogged. I'm afraid it might be a concussion. Oh dear. Can you remove the hat? I'll see what I can do. It's on tight. I got it up, but. I got it off, but it, okay, there it is. 
my oh god. My, what do we have here? I can't believe that stayed on. A full, lush head of hair. Look oh at this, small. Unbelievable. Check out these roots. It's thick. Can't even run my finger. Check it out. All right. Ow. Oh you, my god. Ow. What is your secret? Yeah, how do you do that? You know when they say, repeat on the shampoo bottles? Rinse. What brands do you repeat? repeat? That was my problem, Ma. I rinsed and I lathered. But god damn it, I didn't repeat. Always repeat. Now look at me, Ma. Bald. I lost it all. No, I'm mad. I'm mauled. That's okay. You sure it's just nothing to do with your testosterone levels and you're just losing hair naturally because that's a genetic trait? Some women like bald guys. Maybe it means so. They're more manly, technically. They have more testosterone. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. All right, my low testosterone friend who has a full head wait, of hair making wait, him a little wait, wait. more dainty. Let's see what we can do about this wound, okay? Running his vitals got a lot of low T. Low T on this one. Oh, wait, no, sorry, I was reading it wrong. It's normal. Okay, well, looks like there's a light gouge, nothing too big. There won't even need stitches. Hooray, hurrah. But we're going to do a little bit of glue to keep it shut. Ooh, ooh, you're not going to like this, Wait, though. Did you just say you're going to do glue? Yeah, medical glue. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Are you going to, like, start huffing glue or something? Oh, hold on a second. <laughs> nope, oh, not oh. Elmer's glue. Okay, hold on a second. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Um, uh -oh. That was only a small... <gasps> okay, uh, Dr. Pepper, come with me, please. One second, let me yeah. speak to you in private. What's going on? That was a smaller wound of two wounds. He's got a larger wound on the back. He's probably in shock, didn't feel it. We're gonna need to shave off that luxurious hair of his. No. Good no, God, Ma. I think you're right. No, no, no. When I no, ran my fingers instead. through that lush head of hair, I knew something was awry. Let me out of here. Let me out we gotta here. cut that thing off, Ma. It's gotta go. It's gotta go. We have to get. We have oh. to get to the wound. You know that all that luxurious hair is in the way. We're gonna need to shave it all off. We can try, Ma, but it's just too damn thick. It's unsanitary. Well, yeah. uh. It's too thick, Ma. Time is of the essence. Clippers. Okay, here we go. Please don't touch my I'm, head. I'm terribly sorry, sir, but we're going to need to shave off your head to get to the wound. It's just so thick and luxurious. We can't make it in there, all right? Just see what we can do. I'll hold him just down. Pull the plug. I would get sued incredibly by the hospital. I lose my job if you were to pull the plug over it. Just a small wound on your head. I'm going to have to shave your head to save your life. Do you understand? Oh, I'm terribly sorry. You're going to look like him. Where'd what? you go? What's that supposed to mean? Alright, I'm gonna turn on the razor here. We're gonna start cutting this oh. thing, alright? Oh. Easy, Ma. Not the eyebrows. Watch the eyebrows, Ma! Not the eyebrows again. That was a close call. Alright. You're not completely bald. Just enough to get to the wound. Okay. The wound's been cleared. Ooh, quite the cul de sac we have now. Okay. Stitching it up. There we go. Cleaning the excess. A large dent in your skull. All right. Large nap. Large dent there in the skull. You see that? I do. That's yeah. where the news van hit. That's why oh, he's yes. got the lush hair. Bit yeah. of a cartoon he's got bump. An odd shaped cranial. Yes, yeah. like Wiley e. Coyote. He's got that bump. You don't see that yeah, a lot. That, yeah. Takes a hard hit to make the little bump like that. Takes All a right. news, news van. Takes a We're news van. So that shot. All right. Apply a bandage. Okay. Once again, I am terribly, terribly sorry about your wonderful hair. Whoa. But don't worry, it grows back. And yeah, Mar, I, hope so. I need you to step aside. I'm going to attempt something. Oh God. I'm going to go take care of that patient, okay? Don't worry, I got this. Now, sir, I'm going to attempt to do a maneuver on you. I haven't done in some time since my college years. It's called, oh. a, it's called a comb over. Please don't, please don't. Do don't worry. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. It's fine. I'll just, I'll just shave the rest of it. Hold on. Full scarlet. Yes. A little bit of hair gel. I'm bringing it over. Pommy. 
pomade. Here we go. I'm bringing it in. Don't worry, I've got it. Yes. I'm coming it over. It's working. My God. It looks like you still have a whole full head of hair. No one will ever know. Hope not. Good God, I've done it. The impossible. Science guide us. Science help us. Help us all. Now arise. Arise, my champion. Arise! Oh, I'm still, I'm still I'm, my head's still hurting. Oh. I'm still only about 40% good. Oh, well, I'll have to get more for that. I'm, I'm still a trainee, technically. Oh, no. I yes. hear explosions. Yes, it's, uh, there's blimps falling down outside. Don't worry, he'll, he'll be back. I'm on deployment at the moment. I'm All right. Cover. What's the scoop? No more. You're unemployed, but undercover. <laughs> what? Well, you see. The <laughs> uh, squad and I were supposed to be uh, getting deployed to North Korea, but the C-130 military aircraft was way off course. Well, this case Something must happen with the pilot. Uh, after 15 hours in the cargo hold, we uh, decided to airdrop out in the nearest landmass. We ended up in this shithole. It's gonna go on. Squad mates are missing. Our supply crate. <sighs> Must have dropped in the ocean. Australian Ooh, North supplies. Korean spy? Did you by chance come across a crate with a frying pan and a ballistic mask? Hmm. Is he responsible for that? No bridge? joke, stop. Be careful though. I've if got you stay there for too long, a ring of fire will come toward you. Hey, Ma, I hate to interrupt, but the other guy over there is, he needs, I think he said he's 40%. Okay. He's, oh, okay. He's ready absolutely. to go. All right, yeah, here, yeah, all right. Your um, expertise. All right, this one should be good for you uh, to look at. Uh, uh, minor head right. trauma by, it looks like a, some type of, like, lost, uh, Don't worry, sir, I'll be right with you. Keep that hat on. It's okay, go ahead. no worries. All right, let's see here. Oh, hi, Doc. Another Doc. Uh, What's going on? How's it going? How you feeling? Are you better? Are you better than the other doctor over there? Well, it's not a contest. It's just modern science. We're doing the best we can to save lives. How many uh, patients have you uh, managed to get back on your feet compared to putting them in the Borg? I don't know Mars count, but so far, I think I've saved about four lives. And I think he's at about uh, three. So, technically, I believe I'm in the lead. How many are you? Is that today or lifetime? That's not very many for uh, my lifetime. Yeah, would be 23. 23. Only 23. 23. Oh, damn. I've That's saved right. more lives than that uh, in the trenches That's in Gandahar, Afghanistan. Sorry, sir, you're mumbling. Something about Afghanistan? <laughs> yeah, I've saved more lives than. Uh, than what you have in this hospital in the trenches. Thank you for your service. Well, thank you for your service, sir. Yeah, those meds are definitely helping. I appreciate what you've done for this country. It's because of you. I'm able to do this as a job, and I thoroughly love thank saving you. lives. But you, sir, you're the real hero. Uh, that's okay, okay. Doc. You'll be the to hero today when you save my life. Oh, no, no, no. If you save my life. Don't worry, we'll, we'll do the best we can with the best tools we've got. Um, pay more careful where you're putting those fingers. It's a head injury, not lower spine. Ugh. Careful, Ma. This is one of the good ones. A war veteran. A war veteran? Okay. So he says. So he says, yeah, I know. Oh, I need to see your ID then. <laughs> Got an ID there? Okay. Buckaroo. Oh, shit. Someone stole it. Someone stole it. Thank you. Yeah. Do you have a military license? The name. Well, the code name is. Uh, my call sign Sandman. 
Your name is Sandman? I'm, am I hearing this right, Maul? Yeah, I had to earn that one. Sandman. Why is it Sandman? Well, a little kind of bit of uh, military games back in training about 10 years ago. The kids call it hide and seek, but uh, military is um, a bit more hardcore than that, you see. I had to uh, try and escape capture for three full days, so I buried myself in the sand, breathed air through a straw for three full days to evade capture. That's how I earned my name, Sandman. And that's hide and seek? That was touching. <laughs> hide and seek. The middle of Afghanistan. Yeah. Well, You're one of the good wasn't... ones, friend. You're one of the good <sighs> ones. Salute him. Thank you, God. How does the head I look? salute you, soldier. I salute uh, you. That's okay. I actually uh, prefer people that don't salute because that can get you killed in a war zone. Okay, a well, uh, <laughs> let me unsalute you. Bow? It's all right. I appreciate the, the gesture. Here, I'm taking it back. Thank you. I'll use the other hand. Maybe all right. Try getting up. So you need to fill in some paperwork. <laughs> yeah, here, here, try standing okay. up here, and then we'll take a look and see if you have your ID. And from the ashes of nothing arises a hero. A legend. No. No identification, sorry. No identification. Yeah. Um, I'll just write down is... that the Sandman was here. Yeah. Uh, Scout Sandman. I'll write down that Scott the Sandman was here. No, Scout. Scout? S C O U T. That's a name? <laughs> a Who are we to judge, Dr. Pepper? Who Two are more. we to judge, Ma? Forget, I'm writing it down. Are we ready to check this one off into the healthy pile? Scout the Sandman? You are officially in the healthy pile. Godspeed, sir. Thank you, Dots. Be careful Thank out you. there. Be you careful. You can uh, add another one to your list that you've saved today. What's that, up to, up to five now? Oh, and man. more? You're up to four? Well, half Not that it's a competition or anything like that, but I'm no. somewhere around 20. Not a competition. 20? This doc here said you're only up to three. What are we talking about today? The shift? Was it three for you, Ma? Well, this is my, my second shift of the day, technically, so oh. I'm up to 20. Oh, you worked this morning? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I put in double. Oh! Mm. I heard differently. I like, I like Ma's worth ethics. They're good. Yeah, I can't remember Kimby's these days, yeah. Well, all right, then. Looks like you're healthy, Sandman. All right. Let's go hide and see some Go hide in some sand. Take care, Mr. Sandman. Godspeed. <laughs> Night time. Always brings about the worst of injuries. Pity! Come on! Ha! 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 Thanks, Doc. Oh. My God! Pick him up! Get him off the floor! I'm just staring at him! He's flipping and flopping around! What happened? What happened? Tell me what happened! He's flipping and flopping! Uh, he's flipping and flopping! He's flipping and flopping! He had some really serious it. burns. He was involved in an accident. Uh, I did apply him with some burn gel, so it could be that. Burn gel? You know, I'm... The burn gel? Oh, my God! Yeah, I'm just gonna help him up to his and get him in there if he wants. Look at his Dr. eyes. Pepper, 10 cc's of Viagra. We need to stiffen this one up. Get the Viagra! Viagra! Get him up to the IFBPM. Here we go. Lighten him up. Get the Viagra! Viagra! 
Inject it right into the bloodstream, please. Injecting it directly into the taint. It's so slippery, my god. I'm slipping and sliding, Ma. I don't know about this one. I don't know either. All right. Checking over the body, looking for it. Okay, we look like we have oh. second degree burn. He keeps fucking moving around! Ah, I can't work like this, Ma. He's gonna need a sedative. Calm him down. I'm gonna pin him down. You, over there. Wait. Working his volunteer. Wait. Yeah. Hold his legs. Hold An him. An officer's life at stake. Good God, look at him. He's chewing Hold on his, his tongue, Ma. Prolonged eye contact. Okay, let's have a look inside. Open that mouth there. Let's take a look inside. Uh. Oh. I don't see any excess blood. All right. Let's start taking oh, care of he's slipping right. off. Hold, hold on, just hold him there, hold him there. All right, check the burn areas. All right. Okay, we're about to apply a lot of ointment for these burns. You understand? <laughs> oh. You ready? Oh. Ready? Uh. Okay, roll up his sleeves on applying the ointment. Okay. Ointment. Oh, BPM over 60. We have a slight increase. It looks like either A, he's enjoying the touching, or B, things are not getting good. What are you doing? They're... He's stepping off the bed again! Make a call, Ma! Make a call! Apply the loop! Getting more Viagra! I got the Viagra! Stop Apply resisting! Apply over direct contact. There we Ejecting are. Ejecting it directly into the bloodstream! There you go! There! There, that should stiffen him up nicely. Ah, pant tightening. Perfect. Okay. It's tightening up. Shit! Oh no! How many CCs did you put in? You're... Oh god! It was the wrong Get the amount. paddles! Get the paddles! Get the paddles! Oh, ding on Viagra. Alright, I got the paddles! Charging! Here we go! Again! Charge it! Come on! Just zap him! Charging! Zap him good! Clear! <gasps> oh! Oh! Woo! <gasps> it's beeping off! Oh, it's, it's popping off! Okay, we, we'll, we'll have to operate on the floor! Oh, God, God damn it! Wait, Mr. sterilize Mr. the floor! I hope you mop the fuck out of this floor! It's gonna get dirty! Nice yeah, right and the Here we go! Okay, and he's back on the bed now! What the flying fuck? Okay. Now he's... I am rather confused right now. Okay, here we go. All right, the final... fish. He's just the flopping final... around, Ma. What are we the... supposed to do? I don't fucking know. Hold on. Do you have the ability to get a grip on him? I can't get a grip on this entire situation. Physically and metaphorically. Hold on. Okay, final key applied. Wrap the bandages quickly. Before he flames around again. I'm wrapping him as best I can. Wrap! Wrap! I'm wrapping! Wrap God! All right, I'm rapping. Rapping like a 1990s beatboxer. I'm rapping, I'm rapping, I'm rapping, I'm ripping, and I'm rapping. There we go, perfect. Okay, check his, check his uh, uh, fluid here. IV drip's normal. Okay, good, 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 good. All right, hold on a second. Let's see what we can do here. Oh. What the? Ah, this. He settled down. I believe we had the right amount of Viagra to blood ratio. Look at his pants. It just took some time to even out, that's all. That's a 5.7 out of 10 on the erector scale. Even out Lester. scale. Fantastic. All right. Beep boop. Turn the fuck off. There we go. Well. How about hey. that? How about that? Hey, good. Hey, <laughs> round, of, round of applause for the assistant there. Round of applause for the not uh, bad, for Wade. Neighbor. Not bad at not all. Not bad, Wade. Up top, up top, right there. There you go. Looking good, Wade. Community service for the fucking win. Community service for the win. All right, there we go. Oh uh, yeah, just here to help. All right, let's. Ma, see I here. think you got it from here. I'm gonna answer a phone call in my head real quick. Be right back. Yeah, you go do your thing. All right, let's see here if he's gonna come too. Just a light slap. Oh, he'll come too. Oh, he'll come too. They always come. They always come to uh, take a piss. Be right back. I'll do some ketchup. Thank you guys for hanging in, doing some doctor role play. So much fun. I'll give a shout out for you guys. Super generous people out there. Uh, eat your guts with the 100 bitties. Give me some love. Oh, shout out to Chris Marley. Hey. Scoochie with the 31 Twitch Prime. Thank you. Uh, Pillsbury Doughboy with the 420 getting danks. What are the, uh, what's your opinion on the blue DD shirt? 
it's dank as fuck. Everyone should get a DD shirt. If you're not getting a DD shirt, you're not cool. Better get one. Resurrect Gaming, six months in a row. Insomniac, Twitch Prime for four months. Mr. Squeeze, gifting out a sub. Thank you, dude. Eat Your Guts, giving out a whole bunch of bits. Thank Look you, Look at guts. all them bit Thank you, thank you, thank you. Damn. Longboard Lord with the Twitch Prime, 10 months. Okay, Longboard. Appreciate you, dude. Long. Ace Pro Johnny. Welcome back, dude. What up, Johnny? Ace Pro Johnny giving out a bunch of bits, too. Thank you. Bill hey, Pudman. Appreciate that. Mick Hammer. Dude, two years in a row. Thank hey, you, man. Mick Hammer. Uh, Senzuana with a dollar. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Fatimus Prodimus. With the four month, four Senpai months. Strider, 20 months. Thank you, Senpai. Give Speak, Mezzi 2110. Thank you, thank you. AV The Lost, Rudder yeah. Butter, Retro yeah. Stacks. Yeah. Huge Volsack. Nice. Love the name. Nice. Uh, Con the Great with the 14 months. Con! Shouts to my boy Kenny and the Unruly Mob with hey. the host. Thank you, man. We might be coming through tonight, Kenny. Where you at? Dr. Buttfuck with the dollar. Dr. Corleone. Cosmic Craftsman. Shout outs to the Reddit. Hey. Big ol' schling and schlung with a thousand bits. So much support. Thank you, dude. Bend over. I'll eat that ass. Gift down a sub. Flaccid dinosaur. Heavy arm seven. Sunset. Lordless. Classy red dragon. And Dr. Mantis Toboggan. Thank you guys for all the support tonight. You got it the best. Thank you. For your support. You the best. That unruly mob is quite an unruly mob. Oh, that's right. Looking good, Ma. Sorry, what was that? Uh, be safe out there. Yeah, I think I appreciate the uh, the help, doctors. It's gonna help my uh, it's gonna help my uh, sex life tremendously. You guys are very very good doctors. Of course, trooper. Anytime. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. You just witnessed a miracle, Wade. That man's got a divining rod that he's gonna go plow into the dirt somewhere. Four hours. We'll see. Sure it'll turn up in the news. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah, it was coil. And if it lasts longer than four hours, he's doing something wrong. All right, depending how you look at it. Ha! 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 There you go. There you go. Very true. Very true. Ha! Ha! Get some water. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'm gonna make sure there's no ass hattery going on out of here. Oh, the water. Sorry. The cold's never really cold. It's more lukewarm. It's always such a bummer. It's, it's just... hot. It's super hot. Hot's always hot. Oh yeah, hot's hot. Doesn't feel good right there on the tanker sore. Ouch. Fuck it. Sammy Sama with the five dollars. Thank you. And Terry, gifting out a sub. Thank you, Terry. Turbo Buddha coming in hot. Seven months in a row. Thank you, Turbo Buddha. Buddha. Ask about the shop. Did real good. Hey, you guys know what's going on with that gift shop? It's on the fritz or what? Um, no, looks good to me. Oh yeah, I see they actually added a purchasable items. Seems yeah. as though it's uh, malfunctioning, though, or maybe it's just me. Uh, they could be out of stock. Oh, what kind of stuff they carry there? Uh, uh I don't know. I haven't seen. Tasers, fire extinguishers, flowers. Typical. Hospital. Oh yeah, typical yeah, hospital the usual, stuff. The usual hospital thing. Vodka. Yeah. You know, explosives. Well, well, I people. mean, you know, if you run out of rubbing alcohol, you got vodka. I mean, I've done that before. Yeah. Oh, good God, that blimp is still out there on the freeway. Hey, he's just trying to do his job. <laughs> Can't blame him for that. Can't blame him I for that. I gotta say, Wade, you handled that very well in the heat of the moment. Most people would cow in fear when they're surrounded by so much blood and gore and guts and screaming and pain and agony. But you were cool and calm. You done good? Done good, kid. Done good. Uh, three tours of Afghanistan will do that to you. Three? You ever thought about Getting into the medical industry? I know you're older, but we could use a person like you. Male nurse? In the trenches. Male nurse? Mm, yeah, male nurse. Well, uh, it would kind of hinder me trying to open up my skydiving business. Skydiving? Skydive. Skydiving business. Seeing the blimp out there, I don't know if you want to do that. Gotta get my, get my wireless license. That's the whole point of my expungement and doing the volunteers or the community service. 
Ah, I see. I see. Yeah, be careful. You end up like that blimp out there. Yeah. Uh, that might be a cu one of my customers that might end up like that. You know, oh. they're not smart enough to pull the ripcord. Or my customer. Well, now he's our now he's our green, customer. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> zing, <laughs> zing. Oh, I'll be sure to uh, bring him to you. You know, if they, uh, that happens. Uh, in a, in a, they'll probably be in a bucket, though. Yeah, we'll see about that. Is it uh, uh, Afghanistan? You said you were in your past. Uh, yep. Now Green tell me, door. tell me, do you know of a? Scout Sandman, okay. does that ring a bell? I want you to hold on. Um, stop the conversation right there. I don't mean to alarm you, but we have a mul we have five GSWs coming right away. Gotcha. Five, five. All right. Oh boy. Here's the game plan, Doctor Pepper. I need you to assess the first two. I'll take the next three. Wade, I need you to find out by going to each one and find out which one is the top priority. Once you find the top priority, I'll focus on the top one. And trickle my way down. Dr. Pepper, you follow in tow as I follow down that line and take care of them one by one. Let's separate the beds. We'll put one in the critical area in the main front and then try to separate them as much as possible for just so that way we can converse and deal with the person individually. Do you understand? Understood. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Got it. Are you all ready? Shit's about to get real, yo. Give me that shit, boy. It's going down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You ready? It's Always. going down. Bring it. Welcome to Pillbox Afghanistan. Shit's gonna get real. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get to the door. Let's, let's prepare, to, prepare to meet them. Prep the door. Ma. Jeez, five gunshots. Jeez. About to get real, boys. Hell yeah, guns. brother. Coming by meat wagon or sky wagon? I don't know. Let's just wait and find out. Hopefully not by blimp. Yes. Been enough of that. I can hear it. Do you hear it, Ma? The sirens. <laughs> you hear that, wait? Yep. Fun's on its way. Here they come. Come on, everyone. Come on. Positions, everyone! <laughs> Gonna be a good time tonight. Jeez, oh, look at them packed in there. Got to fix our All right, here we go. Remember what I said. I got the first. I got the first set of three. You take care of the next three. Two. All right. Here we go. What do we got? All right. He was uh, shot in the abdomen. Uh, he does have a few injuries as well. Uh, I did uh, go ahead and uh, pack his gunshot wound and get him uh, secured with a blanket to regulate his temperature. However, he does seem to be very cold still. Uh, I did check his breathing. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's not good. Okay, we're going to try to separate them on the beds as well. Try to space them out within the hospital so that way we can work easily. All right. If you want to put the first one right here, greatly please, and then the next one on that. The first right, bed around the, the corner, bed. and then so forth and so forth. All right, I'll start yes, assessing sir. this one. All right, what happened? Oh, uh, uh, did you shoot? <laughs> okay, multiple pack on shot wounds here. We're going to have to open up a couple it's of coughing up a lot. It's uh, coughing up a lot, Ma. Yep. Yeah, I see that. I see that. Hooking up the IV. Here we go. Get the next blood on there. All right, we're gonna have to open him up and see what he has happening on the inside. <coughs> I have internal bleeding. A lot of blood yeah, coming out of there. <coughs> oh All God, right. it's everywhere. Here comes the sedative. Here we go. Gotta slow it down. Gotcha. Might have a lung puncture by the looks of it. Just gotta slow yeah, it down. Little puncture. Little puncture. Little puncture. All right, I found the problem area right here. Yep, bullet scraped right into the right into the lung. Okay. All right, so yeah, so yeah. I'm gonna close yep. up that wound right now. That's it. There we go. Looks good. Okay. Wound area has been taken care of. He's pinking up. 
All right. Looking Checking for good. Damages. Looking good. He's pinking up. Getting some color back in those organs. <laughs> All right. If this won't stabilize, we keep assessing the situation. I'll go on to the next one. All right. I think I fucking... You're in good hands, kid. Uh, Moss, one of the best out there to do the damn thing. Let's see if I can't touch it up here, though. I'm just gonna touch up this. Make sure it's nice and clean. No infections for you. Nope. You're walking out of here better than ever. You understand me? You're cold, I know. I know, I've been there myself. Don't worry, you're, start, you're gonna start warming up here in just a minute. Yeah, there you go. All right. Soothing the area there, some low, there, oh. some sedative there. It's gonna start feeling better. Oh. Gonna bring down that pain level. Let's get one to ten. All right, how how you feeling there? Oh, much. Oh, better. Oh. Feeling good? Oh, I'm feeling much better. Okay. <laughs> Keep looking over, Doctor Pepper. I'm just gonna watch him, see if he can walk out of here. See okay. if he can, can see. Uh, can you walk on your own feet? This is, this is a GSW situation. The police have to keep an eye on him. Just keep All right. Him, please, okay. I just want to see if he collapses. Uh, well, don't go running away now. But can you, uh, it looks like he's able to stand up. All right. Uh, I think you're okay to sort of stand up. You can get off the bed. I'll help you off the bed. His name. Uh, there we go. Uh, Easy now. What's your name there, son? I'm um, Pinto, sir. Pinto Patel. Uh, Pinto Patel. Pinto, Aaron, Pinto, sir. What are, you, what, are you doing, what are you doing back here? I work at Harmony. Uh, All right. So you work anyways, I'm going to give your file over here to the police. They're going to have a word with you. <laughs> you can do that in the lobby, man. Just wait in the lobby. May science help you. Yes, sir. Thank you so much for your service. Take uh, it from here. Thank you. Uh, Thank you so much. Pinto, you, you good, man? Yeah, I feel a lot better. Uh, I can talk. No. Pinto, 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 Patel. Thank you. All right. What's going on, Hotshot? What do we got? Wound. All right, I've a All right, I've a look. I cleaned the wound area. I'm prepared for stitching. If you want to go ahead and stitch up the axe wound, feel free. I'm going to go look up the next one. It's my specialty. What do we got? Damn. All right, Sonny. I'm gonna go ahead and give you the old Dr. Pepper special. Oh, here we go. All right. A little alcohol here. I'm gonna clean it up. Is he gonna make it, Doc? Oh, he's gonna make it all right. Trust me, I've stitched up a whole lot worse in my past. Okay. All right. All right. Good to hear. You're in good. You're in good hands, sir. You're in good hands. Look at that. He's already pinking up. Okay. I'm gonna use a 20 gauge needle here. High thread count. I'm gonna use a high thread count on you. Egyptian, Egyptian silk. Okay. Yes, no scarring for you. It's gonna look flawless when I'm done. You want a cross stitch? All right. Okay, put a little alcohol on it. Here we go, here comes the needle. Need something to bite down on or you good? Yeah, yeah, give me your hand. Yeah, put this cotton ball in your mouth, bite down on this. Okay. All right, here we go. Almost done. Eighty percent. Ninety percent. There it is. Done. Ah. Yes. Let's go, doctor. Oh, Better than new. How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. I'm feeling much better. All right. It's in God's hands at this point, but I think you're going to end up having no scar okay. tissue or anything after that sort of uh, suturing. Looking good. I'm going to check with Ma. Uh, I'm sure the police officers will have a word with you shortly. Okay. Good God. Hey there. Uh, so much plaid. Alright, you're gonna be fine, sir. <laughs> I know, right? Did Jordan make it? Yes, yes. Who's Jordan? He's my boyfriend. Then what does he look like? He's got black hair and a nice tan and a great ass and 
black shirt and black pants. <laughs> What's Sir, up? are you are you Jordan? Okay. All right, Doc. He says his pain level's about a seven out of ten. Uh, he's got an axe wound to the shoulder here. Ah, uh, uh, axe wound to the shoulder, eh? Let's see. Is it hurt to rotate it like this? Let me lift your arm up. Does that hurt? Oh yeah, that looks like it hurts. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna apply some pressure around it. Looks like it's a slight dislocation. We're gonna have right, to re. We're gonna have to relocate this thing. Okay. You wanna hold him down, Wade? When you when you come back, I need you to hold him down. This is good. Scared this guy's sitting here with a shoulder out of place. We're gonna snap this thing back. Ready? I need you to hold him down, Wade. Hard. Hold him down. Time is of the essence. Could lose this arm. Perfect. I got him. All right, son. I'm gonna start working your arm. In the clockwise yeah. motion, then counterclockwise till I hear it snap back in where it should be. Yeah. It's just like a G.I. Joe. Yeah. No worries. All right. Uh. I'm going to get turning it around. Uh. Uh. Okay. Uh. Uh. Okay. Uh. I think we passed it. I'm going to go around the other way now. Uh. There it Rick, is. And uh. got it. Perfect. What do we got here? I put his shoulder back in place. It was dislocated. Oh, shit. But now he's all opened up. I gotta start suturing this thing up. Step aside. I'm going in. Give me some of that alcohol, ball. Good. Alcohol check. There you go. All right. It's gonna be nice and clean. High thread count. Egyptian silk. Here we go. Oh, no, the best. Trust me, when you get out of here, you're gonna have a brand new shoulder. It's gonna work better than ever before. Uh, uh, it's good to know. It's good to know. Okay. Almost there. And. Got it! Uh. Perfect. Is he uh, up? I don't know if he's up, but that shoulder's no longer exposed to the elements. Uh, Let me move out. How you feeling there, kid? Uh, surprisingly, it actually feels a little better than it did before, but... Feeling better. Good. I, I don't know if that's just because you left it alone for a minute. Well, no, no, no. Well, let's, let's leave it alone for another minute. We'll, we'll check how we're doing, okay? Yeah. I'm gonna check on uh, your other compadres. I'll be right back with Maul. Alright. Watch over him, wait. Will do, Doc. Thanks, Doc. No, it's okay. I'll be right back. Okay. Are you all right there, ma'am? Yeah, just okay. kind of in shock, you know? Oh yeah, shock, yeah, that's that's normal. You should be in shock, yeah. that's totally normal. Our job is to unshock the shock. Where are you feeling the shock? Um, mostly the bullet get, get holes. My hands around him. Bullet holes, right. Where did you get shot, ma'am? Um, just above my heart, but it kind of grazed me, I guess, and then in my hip and my thigh. Your head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Is that right? Yeah. All right. Yes. You're going to go ahead and... Yes. Looks like Ma patched most of these up. Yeah, he did. Okay, yeah. Looks like you're just in kind of the uh, wait around till the cops talk to you mode. Oh, okay. Is there anything I can get you until then? Help with the pain? Um, do you have Jello? Jello. Do you yeah. prefer cherry or orange or grape? Um, how about some cherry? I'll be right back. Cherry, I need cherry jello! We only had orange. <laughs> Grape was the winning choice there, chat. Let's all yeah, be honest. Let's be real. Oh, I'm sorry. All we had oh. was orange. Well, at least it's not banana. What? All right, there's some problems. Uh, there's some problems with the patient over there in the far bed. So, um, okay. Just, you know, I'm sure about. Okay. Oh. Uh, is it the one with red hair? Can you see him, sir? Or is it Jordan? Oh, God, please. You're in shock. Please don't let You're in shock. Please. Listen, Mom, just Dr. slowly no. eat the to... orange jello, and it'll all okay. be fine. I don't know where you're getting this idea about okay. banana jello. Must be the shock. I don't believe such thing exists. Your pudding. <laughs> it's horrible. I think you might <laughs> be thinking of, like, a banana cream pudding. Yeah. No, it's, it's definitely it's jello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. It's yellow and it's clear. Ma, this patient seems to believe that there's such thing as banana jello. What? No. 
I think she's thinking. Yeah. That's what I said. I think she's thinking of banana cream pudding. Yeah, no, it's oh, definitely jello. Right, but she says it's jello. No, pretty it's, sure it's pudding. It's that clear. would be pudding. And it, it jiggles when it wiggles. I've never seen a clear banana that jiggles in my life. Lemon, me neither. Perhaps a lemon, maybe. I'd be willing to go there. <laughs> this one, this one might need some time more, some time to cook. I wanted to get the old dementia. Wait, I have dementia? No. What? You'll be fine. What? You'll be fine. Just keep eating the orange jello that I gave no, you. No, no. Okay. Okay. Focus on the jello. It's mushy consistency. Soothing to the touch of the tongue. Easy to chew. Matter of fact, chewing's not even necessary. The, con the tongue can sort of work its way around it, mushing it up into a mushy bowl, mushable, a swallowy bite. Focus on that. Don't choke. Slower. Okay. There you go. You work on that, I'll see how the other patients are doing. Okay. Thank you. May science help us all. Uh, he, he's uh, moving around in my eyes here. There you go, I'm back in bed. Uh, now he's yeah. back in bed. Oh, he Dark might need to be escorted out of bed. Can oh, you yeah. try that? Okay, give me some yep. I got the email. There we go. Oh. Oh, shit. There we go. Oh. The old escort roundabout. Get up in that bed. The old pick him up and slap him down. Works every time. Like me Maybe we should try board. unplugging and plugging it back in. It might be smart enough. God damn it, it'll be crazy enough to work, Maul. The beep what boop, in it? and out? What about the defibrillator? The defibrillator. Only I don't know, it's just a shoulder injury, right? Still can't see him, I'm sorry, I don't, I don't see him at all. I'm, I would love to assist, but I can't with this one. I'm sorry. Uh, what would you like me to do, Doctor? Uh, well, what's, what's, what's the status, Dr. Pepper? Well, I uh, sutured up the whole thing, cleaned it up, a little alcohol, a uh, little Band-Aid on it. Should be uh, feeling better. Unless you need okay, something for I, I just pain. Just, uh, getting him to his feet really is all needs to be done, really. Yeah. Are you feeling okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm feeling uh, a little better than I was. It's fine. Maybe this man's ready to get up. Okay, can you see him, Dr. Ma? No, I, I can't. I can't okay, see him. I'm yeah, sorry. You know, I tried everything I could. He's laying oh, there the, on the, the bed, but... The EMS is more than capable to, to help this person. Yeah. I would love to, but I'm, sadly I can't. Scuffitis. Yeah. It's terminal. You hate to see it. You hate to see it, okay. but it's taken another. All right, do you need to lie back down? Uh, no. That's okay. no, Science will sort them out. Okay. Ow. Oh. I think all of these patients are just about ready to uh, get on up and get out. Get on up and get down. Oh. How are you feeling? Like really tender how and the jello? sore. Like jello. Like, like banana jello. You're right. Just like jello. Like banana. She's all yours, like officer. Uh, okay. Easy peasy. Sorry, Miss Sunday. Uh, as I said, everyone's everyone's gonna be in cuffs right just now. So. Okay. I think they stole my my gun no, and my taser. Oh dear, yeah. Yeah. Sure. How are we doing overall, though? Plaid shoes. I'm, I'm fine with everything else. Plaid shoes. Yeah, go for the bed right now. Plaid okay, well, whenever shoes. you're ready, I believe one of these officers can gladly assist you with Why? that. Why? Yep. Plaid shoes and corduroy How pants. Doing, How you doing? Plaid shoes, corduroy pants. Anything else I can help you with at all? You don't like them? I've seen uh, it all. Are you judging me? <laughs> are you a... Uh, me for the police yet? Okay, <laughs> wonderful. Wonderful. This one's, this one's checked out. Put him in the healthy pile, Dr. Pepper. All right. You. What's your name there, son? You red uh, I'm Carlos. Carlos, putting you in the healthy pile, Carlos. Congrats. Appreciate it, doctor. Muchas gracias. Did not I say to that? 
Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you have si. español? Si. Como estas? Bien, y tú? Muy bien. Muy bien. Si, si sabes español? Muy Maso pequeño. Más o menos. Oh, that damn. Más o menos. Claro que sí. I like it, I like it. Me gusta, me gusta. ¿Qué te gusta? Cerveza. Cervezas. No. Oh, God damn. No cervezas here. No más cervezas. Un hospital. You've been drinking a lot of cervezas. Where have you been drinking cervezas? Wait. Uh, not before I was on volunteer duty. Or it's my community service duties. No mames. No mames. Ja, 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 ja. That's fucking Russian. All right, Carlos, you should be uh, good to a uh, hasta luego. Okay, gracias, doctor. De nada. Uh, let's see, where the hell's Ma? Yeah, doc, and the cops need to arrest them as well. You boys look like you're good to get on up. Uh, cops police. are gonna have to. Cops yeah, are gonna have to deal like, with you. Kind of cops to the bed. Careful, officer. These uh, boys okay. are getting up. Uh, they're ready for you. Don't let them. Uh, okay. Don't let them uh, scurry away. <laughs> Not too worried about it. How am I gonna do that? I'm locked up. Make sure you're <laughs> I'm locked up. <laughs> I'm, locked, <laughs> I'm locked up. Whoa. The fuck is crazy. Yeah, the doctor! Yay! Sounds like the, uh, Phantom Menace, uh, dude. Zaboba! <laughs> I don't think it's- is that Zaboba? Annie, you're crazy! I got your wife! You wanna fall race with me, Annie? I sold your mama to oh, a no, no, not him, but the other guy. The guy that works in the shop. What up? Who is Zaboba? Zaboba's the other guy. He's like, yeah, yeah. He's like a little... He's like in the pod race, but the other guy's like the oh, shop Oh, that's owner. right. <laughs> I'm getting my pod racing. Yeah, yeah but then he's cool. Yeah, yeah. Actually, uh, officer, officer, uh, Excuse me. If she wants to go back and visit, is that fine? Or? Definitely told him you like beer. I know a survey, Sassy. See? You can look at the Jordan's recommendation. Do you want me to be in your ice tag? Fan-fucking-tastic work, team. We did it again. Fuck yes. Looks like we did it, boys. Yeah. We saved them so they can go to prison for the rest of their lives. <laughs> we're doing God's work. Doing what we were sent here to do, or putting it down. You say, hey, Doc, so putting it down. Questions proposed here. What's up, Wade? The pink-haired lawyer. Is there anything you can do about her brain? Her brain? Yeah, she doesn't quite understand philosophies, which is why I think she misunderstood you, Doc. Hmm, maybe. Maybe. Philosophies, Ma? What? Mm -hmm. What? Huh? I mean, you think she might have a tumor or something in a, the part of the brain that, uh, you know, understands... No, but she does have a metal plate meaning? up there. Listen, oh, well, listen, wait, wait, things. wait. Just because someone's stupid doesn't mean they need surgery. There's a lot yeah, of stupid wait. people out there. It's surgery 101. Yeah. Well, I'm not to be Didn't you, you saw the blimp? Yeah. You saw the blimp outside. That's just stupid people doing what stupid people do. <laughs> stupid is okay. stupid does. Can't fix stupid. You Fair can't enough. fix Fair it. This will be a hard lesson for you to learn, Wade. I see you eyeing that woman's brain. Ain't no going in there unless she asks way. for it. I thought you were better. Well, no, 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 no. My way of fixing stupid is duct taping them to a wall, because then they can't hurt themselves. Duct tape That's to a what... wall. That's what crazy people do, Wade. We don't do that here. All uh, right, yeah, you guys got the straight jackets. That's right, the straight jackets, exactly. Keeping my eye on you, Wade. What? Keeping my eye on you. I didn't oh, bring no duct tape. shit. You got the pepper eye now. Ooh, good luck. Pepper spray. Got a little pep eye on you. I, I swear, Doc, I didn't bring no duct tape, I swear. Let's keep it that way, Wade. Let's keep it that way. The only tape we got here is surgical tape, and it's for surgeries. And not lobotomies for people who are just stupid. Just because they're stupid. We really? need stupid people. Yeah. How boring would it be if there were no stupid people? What would you laugh you guys, at? You'd be out of a job, really. I mean, stupid people are the ones who get in the car accidents most frequently. Yeah, what would you laugh at on your 
your your Instagram and your 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 apps on your phone. Stupid people falling down. We mm. need them, Wade. Don't we do? Yes, we need them. I don't argue, Doc. You're right. All right. I apologize. Good. Let's keep I, that I straight. Don't have your, your, your oh years of medical trainings. Well, not all of us were lucky enough to go to DeVry, Wade. Been fun having you here, Carlos. I appreciate it, Doctor. What's your name? The name is Pepper. Dr. Pepper. Oh, god damn. Like the fucking drink that tastes like salt water? Yes. Just like the soda. Excuse me, are you... Did you just point something at me? I didn't see that. I saw it. Yeah, I definitely did. What'd you point god at me? Damn. My gun. What Check the... That flashlight. The oh, heck are you right. doing? This is a place of medicine and healing. Not cow yeah, not yeah, cowboys and Indians. Of, uh, Excuse me. Of healing gets ambushed a lot, so yeah. Just gotta be prepared. Alright, well you can play your cops and robbers out there with all the blimps falling down on the street. Yeah, but we play uh, cops and robbers inside the hospital too. I bet you do. I've seen the way those officers look at each other. Are you objectifying me, sir? No, they objectify it's each 2019. other. 2019. I can vote. Oh, you can? Yep. Oh. Yeah, well, shit. Damn. It, Los Santos is making big changes. It. Yeah. All right, so you're taking these away so you can go play cops and robbers at your place or what? That's what I'm saying. Goddamn. Is that what's going on here? I am not they play cops and robbers at like your place, honestly. Attitude. Listen, plaid. I'm getting real tired of all that plaid. You've been plaiding up in here with your plaid shoes and your plaid shirt. It's enough plaid for one one hospital. I'm gonna fucking die of my hair plaid just to spite you. Lock him away. Please, get him out of here. <laughs> and Arona. Pointing guns around. <laughs> and do you, uh, you said they took your, their, your taser, your pistol. Uh, yeah, God, I love uh, Carlos. Carlos is crazy. Las Vargas, dude. Las Vargas was Annie. Annie, you need to do fundraising, Annie. <laughs> Ay, no Las, Las Vargas was cervezas. You know, they even, they even got the kind where it's like, uh, it's like colored now, so you can like, you know. It is popping off like here. Hospital's just the parking lot now. I really wish the gift shop worked. I'd really love to buy some. Sticky ribs. Fat chips. Big cheese. Some suds. And let's not forget those earthquakes. Earthquake. All right, I need. I think I'm gonna get off my ship. Oh no. It's kinda like. Come territory. Okay. For a rainy day. You never know. All right, Ma. I think I'm out for the day. Clocking I think out. I'm out for the day too. No, I think you and no. I have to go hit the back nine. No. And then no. she might hit the back nine on her boss later. Trust me. No, definitely work out, not. Huh? You sure? No, no. What? I don't want you guys to leave because I like when you guys are doctors. You guys gave me my metal cranium. Oh. Well, hold on a well, second. Thank you. Hold on. Let's just feel it here. Oh, still intact. Nice. Sounds like wood. Yeah. Yeah. So I like when you guys are, you know, on duty and stuff because, um, I don't know. Actually, I got a little bit of a little bit of trouble. Actually, I was supposed to, uh, uh, check with, uh, brain surgeon expert before doing that. But in the moment, you know, you have to work accordingly. Mm, no, you guys did what was right. And look, I'm alive and I have a me better cranium than I did before. No more baby brain. Well, I must say, you're the first one of the day. Nay, now the whole month to at least say thank you for what we've done. Oh, do I do I smell a group doctor? Uh, so, I think it's on order for a oh, group God. doctor sandwich hug. Count me in, Ma. Oh, doctor hug. Okay, 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 I'm ready. Count me in, Ma. Three. All right, go. Two. One. Doctor group hug. 
Ooh. Bring it in. Okay, donkey. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Let's go get some golfing. All right, we'll I'm see out. See you again. Bye. Good luck. Good luck. Ah. <laughs> Push the door. Down. Gotta get out of there. Free at last. Dude, five gunshots. I think Ma's changing. Yeah, Ma's got the RP walk out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for watching tonight. Oh, let me say bye to Ma. Yeah. Well, well, look at you. Looking good, Ma. Thank you, thank you. Looking spiffy. Okay, I, uh, I, am. I still have yet to get myself some civilian clothes, but uh, work never seems to stop, so maybe it's I quite all right that I just wear the lab coat every day, all day. I say it suits you better than anyone else. Never take it off. Wear it with pride. I will. We did good work, Ma. We did Damn good me. work. All right. I'll see and you damn it, next time, I have to say, Ma, I'm proud of you. And I'm proud of you. Until next time. How about Until the old, time. you walk this way, I walk that way? All right, I'm going to go that way. I'm going to go back in the hospital and go downstairs, okay? All right. Until next time, friend. I'm going to go Until over there and check out that blimp. I want to see what happened. Ooh, yeah, that's good. That sounds like a lot of fun. All right, you do that. All right. Take care. Goodbye, friend. Classy packs, everybody. That dude's fucking awesome. I love Classy. You guys need to go follow Classy if you're not already. Follow the Classy Schmacks. Where's the camera? Boom, there it is. Hey, follow everybody. that Classy Packs. Give it up for Classy. Yeah. And he's doing a lot of the hard work, like actually inputting the commands to heal and stuff. So it's a lot of hard work on his end. We just role play being doctors. We're just out here. Saving lives. It's all we can do. Uh, shouts to Hazy Influence and So Pro Artist. Thank you guys so much for your continued support with the subs. Really appreciate it. Yeah, uh, Gifty Subos, Subs, the Primers, the Titties, the Bitties. You guys are letting us uh, seriously live the dream. Shouts to the Lurkers. You guys make the growth of our platform continue. Thank you guys for watching and uh, memeing it up. And shouts to everyone in the chat. You guys are crazy enjoying those new emotes. And uh, don't forget, we got a lot, lot stuff a lot, on screen. There's a lot there. We got a new uh, DD dog t shirt, mugs, pillows, socks. A lot going on there. Teespring.com slash cool dog DD. Celebrating the new emote. DD merch. Celebrating cool the new D. emote. And huh, Jabuvo. The next championship week. series. It starts next week, so you guys need to get in the Discord right now. Go to the Fight Club and register if you want to get in on the Smash Tournament or the DBZ Fighter Tournament. Not all of us can make it to Evo. Oh, boy. <laughs> but, uh, God damn it, all of us can make it to Jabuvo. Mm -hmm. That's right, folks. And uh, if you guys are new to the channel, give us a follow. Appreciate it a lot. Appreciate you guys watching. You could be anywhere, but you are here tonight. And uh, we are hard at work on the next dub. It's like in the mix. It's gonna be fucking amazing. You guys can't, you guys can't wait to see this next one. It's fucking amazing. Joe Nova says, "Fly the blimp." It looks like somebody's in there. Should we run down there and see if we can even get in it? I doubt we Fuck can. It. But um, as we just thank you guys again and again, you guys are uh, best community on Twitch. I think uh, was it? It was Dr. Pepper that flew the helicopter, right? It might be. I think it was Dr. Pepper, actually. Looks like someone's in there. Just to see what happens. <laughs> you know what? Dr. Pepper's shoes are so accurate. Those are like oh, such like yeah, doctor dude. shoes. Hello? Oh my god. Oh, we're scuffed. <laughs> every, every. <laughs> nope, scuffed. Uh, it's Escuffo. And I feel like no cars are, like, working. Yeah, Coil. Coil needs to fix it, dude. <laughs> Coil's making a fucking badass server here, but sometimes shit slips through the cracks, boys. Hey, who would have thought? And it makes it entertaining. I love it. 
Yep. I fucking love when it happens. Let's get Pepper out of here before he fucking dies playing Frogger. Dude, that might have been the busiest, like, hospital. Like, five gunshot victims yeah, at once? That's it was a lot. uh It was kind of dead there for a sec, and then all of a sudden, when it rains, it pours, boys. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, guys. Again, new t-shirt. And uh, there's a lot there. There's tank tops, pillows, socks. I'm looking forward to the pillow. I want a cool DD pillow. Women's tank top. There's a whole lot there. Yeah. So go in there, get in there, get wet. And uh, Jabuvo. Yeah, guys, Jibuvo. join the Discord. Jibuvo. Get Jibuvo. on the Jabuti Evo tournament. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. Let's make this an annual thing. Yeah, let's make it a bigger deal than Evo. That's what yeah. I say. That's what I says. And uh, we'll be back tomorrow. We will. Uh, so, yeah, Discord, blah, blah, blah. You guys know what to do. Yeah, um, regular schedule time going? for tomorrow. Tomorrow? What's tomorrow? I don't Thursday. even know what day it is anymore. Tomorrow's Thursday. It's Thursday. Tomorrow's Thursday? Yeah. How the fuck did that happen? Yeah, fly, flies, dude. Yo, Alex. What hey, up, dude? Hey, Alex. How you doing, Thanks man? for the raid. We're on our way out. You can help us go uh, meme it up, dude. It's classy, dun, dun. Let me just see. Is Clancy done, 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 done? He's done, done. Yeah, he's done. Oh, he Ooh. hosted B-Fly. Let's help him out. I love B-Fly. She's so good. Let's host B-Fly. I feel like... Was she that character and then switched? She might have switched. All right. She's she's going. Uh, B-Fly, 10 out of 10 RP since day one. Going all the way back mm -hmm. to early Jerry Curl days, dude. Early Curl days. Show her some love! Let's do it, boys. Get in the Discord. If you want to do the fighting tournament, there will be prizes and things. And check out the new shirt, dude. Yeah. I'm so hyped for this. Like, I I went in. I bought, like, everything. Yeah, I got the mug. The I got the shirt. I got the jacket. I got this. I got the that. I got the pillow. Oh, man. All right, guys. We'll see ya! Peace! Get in there and Roy B fly. See you guys tomorrow. Peace. Bam, 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 bam.